money for to hey, hey, hey. Call a pastor, call a priest to get the devil out. Hey, hey. Observer. Radio, as we are here from uh, the Winter Park uh, Sports uh, Stadium, but we are more located at the forecourt. And tonight, uh, the first after two years of virtual calypsos, um, we have again a, a trio, I should say, of the Swinging Stars band. We can uh, see uh, Peter Lita and uh, the bass man and a guitarist uh, uh, tonight. Uh, good evening to you, Edgar Wanta. Good evening, Cecil, and good evening to your listeners. I want to wish everyone come. I guess it's going to be a new year, so we can wish everyone Happy New Year. And I'm so happy that Calypso is back, you know, in a real true form, that the crowd is back in the venue, and I'm sure we're going to have two rounds Calypso this year. When you said the real, the real crowd, well, last year and the year before, uh, we had two beautiful, first one wrong, um, where people were actually present, you know, but we had COVID-19 and we had that distance six feet apart. Well, yes, well, that's what I'm saying. I'm happy. As they say, we are outside, and I'm happy that everyone is outside, and we are back to Calypso in it real form, you know, where the crowd can be singing along with the Calypsonians and making it as interesting as it should, as it should be. And that's for, for sure. And uh, we know that the Calypso Association will st start some time, uh, but tonight we know that there was some rain and there was some um, arrangement, and uh, already... The master of ceremony came on stage um, as an indication that we are ready to start. Uh, tonight, uh, we'll be carrying this live uh, through our sponsors. And we are seeing that the uh, people actually trickle in and trickling in um, for the first uh, of, um, away from the virtual. And we're hoping that this year uh, will be a big year. You know, Edgar, this year we have decided to get people from um, within the, the, the doors of DBS Radio. And we have one with us, uh, James uh, Rodney. Good evening to you, sir. Good evening to you, Mr. Joseph. Good, um, good evening, Edgar. And good evening to our listening public, the Calypso listening audience out there in Radio Land. As we are live here this evening, DBS Radio, to bring you coverage of the 2023 Calypso season, which kicks off here this evening with the Calypso Illuminations. Mr. Joseph, and we have quite a very, very, very interesting lineup of Calypsonians yeah. who are getting ready to give us a sneak peek as to what their renditions will be for the Calypso season this um, 2023 carnival season. Well, we actually see in Sai. We know that Sai hasn't been uh, in the arena for some years. I suspect he's going to give us a little bit of maybe what he would have sung this year because he was actually up for this year to sing, but um, we can see that he's not part of the competition because his name is not on the list. Well, I see Sai is going to do, I think, one from the NC. You know, Sai, you know, is known for as a, also as a, an entertainer. So I think they just brought him into whole space, so he's going to do something from the NC. I hope he's singing tonight because Sai is a Calypsonian. No, he, no, he isn't it? singing tonight. He's well, not in the competition tonight. Well, such a disappointment because Sai is a Calypsonian and I always look up to, you know, very energetic and he, with that, 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 that baritone type of voice, you know, he brings a, a certain type of, uh, of Calypso to the whole Calypso business, you know, so I was really expecting to see him back in the Calypso arena. Uh, James, you know, tonight you're going to be giving the first hint uh, uh, to be part and parcel of uh, a, a, a big night, uh, which is the elimination. I'm trying to wonder how do you feel at this time? Well, I'm cool, calm and, and collect, you know. Um, I want to say thank you, Mr. Joseph, for the opportunity to, to gain first-hand um, knowledge and experience of Calypso commentary. And um, it's, a, it's going to be a very interesting um, experience for me. And I look forward to being on this um, honorary panel with you and Edgar. 
And um, right now, as you mentioned earlier, we have Sai, who is giving a rendition from the MC as sort of a warm-up to this evening's um, Calypso eliminations for the season, the Real Mask 2023. Uh, and we know that in the absence of um, Calypso, there's no carnival. Uh, wherever you are in the region, Calypso is a big thing, you know. In Trinidad, we know about Calypso's in Trinidad, in Barbados, in Antigua, uh, in St. Lucia, in St. Vincent, in Grenada, wherever you are, you know, Calypso really makes part of the season of carnival. And tonight, uh, um, the start of the Calypso season, we've started first with the eliminations. Yes, Cecil, and I mean, what, from what I saw, we have some really interesting Calypsonians. The Daddy Chess is back, so we have one king that's been that's back. I am Shani started last year, and I see that she will be on tonight, a, fi a finalist from last year. I see a number of finalists, so I expect a really big show tonight. My only concern is going to be very long, and if they haven't started yet. You know, we have, uh, from what I've seen, we have 53 on the list so far. And I heard the observer said earlier there are some persons who are not on the list who may be added to the list. So I expect us to maybe have up to 60. And you know, each, each person singing two verses, you know, so that gonna, uh, we're going to have a long show tonight. I expect us to be out here maybe 12, 1 o'clock tonight. Well, tonight, uh, uh, again, we have some 55 Calypsonians, um, Edgar. A very long night, as we know, eliminations, even if it's two verses and two courses, there are some Calypsonians for sure. We are going to see Thunder not singing two verses. Well, I shouldn't say not singing two verses. Because if you have to understand Calypsos or Calypso, Thunder is actually singing his two verses and his two courses. Well, for, 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 for Lord Thunder verses are very long sometimes. I hope this year he caught it a bit because, you know, his verse continue from one verse into another verse. You know, so as you say, some Calypsonians with some very long verses tonight so we'll have some very long two verses that may be like five verses so i know as i said it's going to be a very long night i hope we end by let's say 12 one o'clock tonight well we have tonight um as i said um three other calypsonians that have been placed in um 53 unwanted um 54 um dublin and i think 55 top top of top okay well uh, uh, again as i said i mean this is the opportunity for all calypsonians to show their stuff and I mean, I like the fact that the Calypso Association respects all Calypsonians, but I always call for a, a pre-elimination process where we could, you know, maybe even if it's a band house um, process where we could, you know, cut it down to about 30, you know, so that we get a tighter elimination, you know, and I think you'd even get bigger crowds if you had a tighter elimination. And, and, and also to um, Edgar, we have been speaking about in the past, um, really getting some people to stay in the yard, but we have heard um, the former president, that is Ghost, um, stating that some people would require their five minutes fame. But while that is so, I, I don't believe it should be at the expense of the patrons who would really come that really witness some good voices. Yes, and as you say, it um, affects the quality of, of the show. James, I get, I'm sure you have something to say on this. Oh, yes, um, I tend to agree with you, um, Edgar. You know, probably we should really look into it as having a, a pre-elimination show where um, some of the newer, newer voices could um, probably be placed before a panel and give their, their rendition to see if it's um, of quality and substance to be able to be on the actual elimination show. So that probably we could um, eliminate the length of, 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 the, of the process. Uh, as as we have had it for so many years. It's not necessarily um, um, James the, the newer voices. Uh, I, I think that um, every voice uh, mm -hmm. should be in the yard, and so we can choose because we have 55 names. Why can't we not choose the best 45 out of the 55? Right. And and what it does, it, it really cuts down time and give the listeners an opportunity right. to really have a, a more valuable um, 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 show. Right. Yes, and it's just like DBS having its, its Christmas song contest. I'm sure you get maybe uh, 50, 60 entries for the song contest, but you know, some just doesn't reach the kind of a standard that you expect, you know, so you eliminate. So, what they could do, as I say, it could be live, go in the band house and have a, 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 a band house wrong. Right. And from the band house wrong, then you can select, let's say, 45, and that 45 could come into the pack and we know we have 35 i mean the comedy is important and i know we'll still get the comedy but let's their comedy be interesting and creative not just comedy that we come to laugh at you you know yes i agree and um, um just on, on a point uh 
we know that we are the nation station and we also come to educate our, our listeners. And I know that um, some listeners who have heard the names of the Calypsonians who are slated here to give their rendition this evening, that, you know, it, in customary times, that Calypsonians who are, would have made the quarterfinals, semifinals, would not necessarily be placed in the elimination round. But we noticed that quite a few of the Calypsonians, like Shanice and Mystery, who took part in the virtual competition, are placed back in, into the elimination round. So perhaps we could educate our listeners as to why that, that is the case. Well, as, as the Calypso Association said, that the two virtual years wasn't really the real Calypso competition. You know, they really wanted to do something because people were under the COVID pressure and they wanted to give people the Calypso remedy. So that's why they did the virtual competition. And they must be complimented highly for such. But they said that the king will not be recognized like, like so JD is still the Calypso monarch of Dominica. And they're starting afresh this year. So people like Shanice, it's basically their first year in the Calypso monarch competition. They took part in the virtual. So that's why they are starting back at that at that level, at the elimination level. And, but as I saw King Dice join on stage as one of the MCs. MCs. Yeah, he has started, I think, last year or the year before um, in, at his tent. And uh, this year we see now he's into the big arena. And the first Calypso is already on stage. Um, the Lioness, uh, there's no judgment. Let's go on stage for the Lioness. I know you may think I am on top there That I'm a topic I was to address I don't think the Hansel will take my case The kinds of people I have to upset When Tarina said she wouldn't wash place I really did not understand yet But now it's rubbing all in my face Love and interject Cause I'm feeling The attitudes of society Now I youth Had him moralized Purposefully And when none will take responsibility The animal in me Has to address somebody In this depressed society And I may do it on my of our children I cannot suit the way it's a yeah. and I know this country has a problem uh.
because I feel it depend from the demise of our children. I cannot cover for them again. And I know this country has a problem. One more time. But that is what we like about the guy, so you know. Yes. You see the issues already start coming out? Yes. Well, uh, we just heard the lioness. She sang uh, um, for us tonight, Edgar. Um, Lioness Royan, something like that. I have to roar. Lioness was roaring. Yes, I have to roar. Talking about the issues, basically, that's what I get from the song. Well, I, I kind of like the concept, you know. Yes. Her name is Lioness, and then she's roaring. I always like Calisonian to do that about themselves. Yes. But as you can see, she did not roar too much. She's a very soft lion tonight because, I mean, she. She seemed to be very nervous, you know, and it, it, I guess she didn't even know the song very well. Yes. And she struggled, basically. You I, know? I, I don't use the word did not do the song very well. I, I, I rather say that she forgot a, a, a line or two. No, well, the thing is, you know, maybe she just got the song and she's trying to learn it, you know, for so I wouldn't put too much pressure on her. But I would like to see that song as the season goes on, you know, yes, to uh, see how it develops. We, we have the next Calypsonian who's coming on stage. And uh, the, the next Calypsonian should be the um, Lush, Luscious, I think. The Luscious, so yes, up. yes. Um, it's not Luscious first time around, as we know. Yeah. And, Actually, uh, I think it's that's a second year. Second year. Luscious sang uh, yes. last year. Yeah. Well, she was in the virtual competition last year. Yes. That's on stage now. Nice. Hey! Da -da I left my job, I retired, decided to do agriculture. All crops I grow, single toker, killing it slow. As an entrepreneur, those losses I could not bear, got a visit. From the Minister of Agriculture But to my surprise My disappointment was his blessing When he tasted my sour song The man started yelling Why? Luscious, tell me Why a sour song? Sweet soul Luscious, tell me Oh, your soul was up, big, big soul. Tell us your secret. Is it thing organic? Oh, your soul, juicy soul. Are you using chemicals or that thing growing natural? Tell us, we want to know. How oh, your soul was up, sweet soul. Woo! Yeah? Da da da. Lush, lush, huh? Da da da, da da da. I decided to have an exhibition so they can view my plantation. They want to see me in action to develop a good business plan as a specialist in my field. I must give good satisfaction So when they taste it It will be the fruit of choice Wise men came from the east They all line up for a piece When they tasted that piece They all started doing the twist Why? Luscious, tell me How oh, your sour up? Luscious, tell me how your sour up, big big soul. Tell us your secret. Is it organic? How your sour up, juicy soul? Are you using chemicals 
or that thing growing natural? Tell us, we want to know. How your soul so pam pam so? Hey, da da day, da da day. Hey, huh? Oi, oi, da da day. Yes. Well, well, I love this one. I love the concept of this one. So a soap. It's a little smart here, I would like to say, but in an agricultural way. But I won't be so hard on her to say smart here. I think she, you would be hard on her. I think the writer tried to be a little creative on the word so a soap. I didn't see the but I, I, I understand what she's trying to do. I wouldn't say it's smart. It's, you, no, no, it, no, it's no. the play but on the uh, word so a soap. Edgar, I think we, we, we sometimes I know that we go to church and but if the fact uh, talking about why your sauce so, so sweet, why your sauce so, so big, yes, we are using fertilizer. I mean, this is if Sparrow sang that song, you would have said you would have been the first to say it is a smarty word. No, smarty I, I think it's a play on the word sour soap and smarty the agriculture, and, mm -hmm. and I, w I wouldn't call it smarty. <laughs> I, I want to hear the voice of um, <laughs> um, uh, James. Well, uh, well, what I would say is, um, is that was a, a very good attempt to give a description of sour soap. You know, um, when she give the, the reasoning as to why all her other crops were not growing. So, so Shanice is the next one. So, what's up, song last year? Baba um, ba, um, ba -ba Shop. And tonight we have Shanice, who came out second, who sang Sister to Sister. Let's go on stage. Shanice again. Bright and early one Sunday morning. I hear my neighbor call and she calling. Neighbor, neighbor, come here, come look. I can't believe what I see. She cried as her hand shook. She saw her come home last night. Seems he was in a fight. And the whole scene broadcast right on Facebook Live. The young man in the street lay there dying. While people standing watching and filming His sister staring straight at she phone Frozen in shock watching her brother die alone There are no right words to say To a family grieving that way So my words I get to you are here today And tell me where's the humanity In this year's society we failing abysmally right now Like we done with civility No desire for decency Vice and depravity abound Slumbering people arise Wake up and open your eyes When will we folks realize We going under Going under, and if we don't recognize, it's high time to change our vibes. Uh, well, yes. Yes. not so sure what happened um, from the band. It seemed the band cut off on stage. Yes. On, and Cecil, I, feel, I was following I this, this one. one. Hashtag. This is a very interesting calypso. Yes. Nice journey. Yes. And it's something we very concerned about in our society. Oh yes, yes and, that. And, and I'm happy that that, that first um, concern about the issue of hashtag and and and, and um, the videos that we have been seeing is placed uh, on the on the back burner tonight um, by a Dominican um, because we have been hearing about calypsos and this one is of great concern to many of us and this one uh, tonight is really seeing something serious yes I, and i like the seriousness because we're so caught with the camera and want to record that we we losing our humanity you know and i really want to congratulate shanice and whoever wrote this piece this is a, a call so to me is a big one i just heard one verse i was, i wanted to hear what the second verse was about to say and, 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 uh, can we ask james to join yes yes and uh, i share your sentiment um edgar um as the, as I was listening to her um, in that first verse, it really resonated with me because that is an issue that I myself has always struggled with to really understand why is it that when our fellow brother or sister is in a situation that our first impulse as of late is to take out your phone and to record, to post and stuff like that. 
So the fact that she could put that issue into song is really one that I think is going to resonate with a lot of people and become very popular for this season. And not, and not just putting the issue into song, you know, it's the, the way it is written. Yes. Crafty, really, really good writing. You could follow, very developmental. It took you on a journey, and as I said, I wanted to hear more and, and very until early, the technical difficulty happened. And, and, and very early, we can also talk about the melody of this one. You know, um, it's just, it's more or less um, very raw uh, in its raw stage, but uh, you could sense, you know, from the melodious aspect of that one tonight, uh, um, it's going to tell me that um, it's going to be a big one for twenty um, twenty three. Um, we are not saying that um, she's going to go to the next stage because we are not a judge. But tonight, uh, from what I've heard so far. She sounds like someone is going to go places. Well, so far, I mean, that she, to me, she should be the top song so far. <laughs> so far. Yes. Yeah, I agree. Remember, you have 55? 55. To yeah. choose 12. So far, three have, have, have sung. <laughs> yes. And um, it's a clear indication that um, the show is going far, but fine. But if we have to continue this um, hitches that we just saw and, and is witnessing at this time, we're going to have some, a real long night. Yeah. You know, but, but really. Um, but you know, I think the why does make the caption and sing a cappella and move oh, yes, on? Yes, they, they can. Yeah, you know, they I can. mean, you don't need to have music if it's we having technical difficulties. We have a long doing, night. She was doing well singing a cappella. Yeah, I think she, she should have back. continued yeah. singing. That's all. But I think Peter Little stopped her. I maybe wanted to give a fair, a fair chance like every other person. Uh, this is elimination. What we want to hear is a nice melody and her lyrics. Mm -hmm. 35 points for melody and 45 points for lyrics. We have seen in the good old days where persons would just come and just sing a cappella. Yes. No, everybody want, no, want to go into the whole melody and stay with, with music. Yeah. Because you're not even hearing her arrangement of her song, so it means that they haven't even gotten the arrangement. It's just a Flats. drum beat, yes. basically, yes. following her, you and know? And the bass, the bass man is following yeah. along with the guitar, yeah. you know, which is which really good yeah. in terms of the, the kind of um, musicians that are really here, really backing up the, the, the singers. I, I must say, though, tonight, um, Edgar, that DBS Radio started the whole process of um, bringing the eliminations. I remember many years ago, um, DBS brought the, the, the first um, elimination at the Bayfront, when Spider sang that song about the mayor and dogs in the city. And tonight someone reminded me that, hey, there's so many dogs in the city. We wish that you were the mayor again. What this song? Going down slowly? Going down slowly. Yes, that was the song. And he did not make it did not to make the it finals. That yeah, yeah, that, and, and, and that has become one of the biggest calypsos in Dominica. Yes, so far um, we have heard this song on an annual basis. Um, going down slowly. And it's now, only now people are catching up to the real lyrical contents of this one many a times you know the calypso just take some time before it really builds on you but spider is one who suffered a lot because spider is very deep spider lyrics i mean is not the normal asking cliche kind of a lyrics his lyrics is very deep very spiritual too you know so you have to basically follow him you know james yes Yes, and um, I, I agree because Spider, Spider has been one of my favorite Calypso songs as well. And um, he, his songs are, have really been taken a, a root of its own and uh, have been one that puts you to think a lot. <laughs> you know, it doesn't come off at you right away. You have to listen to it quite a few times to understand and say, oh, wow, so this what is he was really coming at, you know. And um, I guess that is, was always his genius that would allow you to, to think a little more than you would have normally accustomed with the, the other songs of, of Calypso. But when you're a judge of Calypso, you have to listen closely. Yes. And you can there's no excuse for you that the song build on you later. I right. mean if a man has a good song yes. and you understand what he's doing, you have to, you know, and judge him right. Right. But I felt that Spider had, you know, many opportunities. I mean the kind if you you listen to the kind of Calypso Spider yes. classics. You know, and some of them I mean he never, he only won the crown once, right? Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yeah. And I think he deserves maybe more than once. You know, one of the greatest voices, yes. strong, powerful voice in Calypso, you know. I agree. And and one of the things about Dominica, um Edgar and Calypsonians, um, Dominicans love following the Calypsos on an annual basis. And that is why the elimination here tonight, we have seen the crowd is actually growing because people want to start talking about the kind of songs that they are preparing for in twenty twenty three. Yeah, well, Dominicans love their Calypso, and, and, and that is very great for Calypso. As we say, the Calypsonians need, you know, to keep getting more creative, you know, and, and they will get back the big numbers they used to get. Just get creative and do the work, because people love Calypso. Calypso have to do what it has to do. It has to do the storytelling. It must sing about the issues of the day. It must also not just sing about the issues of the day, but it must point us into directions. It must deal with... You know, it's some of the issues we don't want to deal with, you know, the, uh, Calypso, can, uh, Calypso can be on anything, any topic. 
Yes, and um, Edgar, the very interesting thing about it is that Calypso has evolved to the point where now the younger generation is getting involved. In yeah, but let's platform. join. Let's join stage for Shanice again. Sunday morning, I hear my neighbor call and she bawling. Neighbor, neighbor, come here, come look. I can't believe what I see. She cried as her hand shook. She saw her come home last night. Seems he was in a fight. And the whole scene broadcast right on Facebook Live. Young man in the street lay there dying While people standing watching and filming His sister staring straight at she phone Frozen in shock watching her brother die alone There are no right words to say To a family grieving that way So my words I get to you who are here today And tell me Where's the humanity in this year's society? We failing abysmally right now. Like we done with civility. No desire for decency. Vice and depravity abound. Slumbering people arise. Wake up and open your eyes. When will we fall? We going under, going under And if you don't recognize It's high time to change our vibes As a race we will not survive Much longer, not much longer We will in disaster The situation sure got me thinking About this reckless time that we live in Where empathy just gone down the drain And gradually we are growing numb to each other's pain Progressively getting worse It seems we under a curse We don't care who it hurts As long as it entertains So now misconduct online is trending Tell me what's the message we send in Is anything for comments and likes Wapping the children minds You know that can't be right to create a generation with no love, no compassion Is to condemn ourselves to annihilation And tell me, where's the humanity in this year's society? We're failing abysmally right now Like we've done with civility No desire for decency Vice and depravity abound Slumbering people arise Wake up and open your eyes It's time we folks realize We going under, going under And if we don't recognize It's high time to change our vibes As the race survive much longer not much longer we will in disaster hey hey put your hands together my shoulders yes the crowd has actually enjoyed this one again hashtag and uh, believe you me this one is going to resonate um, to the many young people who love Calypsos. And I'm sure that this year we will 
be hearing this message quite a lot so that other people know we come to understand that we have we must have some humanity in us. Not only will it resonate with the young people, but I think it resonate with the whole society. Because I think, you know, this social media thing has basically taken control of us. You know, and we as you see, we as she said in the song, we more concerned about the love and the likes. And before this add the next Calcinian um next Calcinian on stage I think it's DBS. Yes, mighty DBS. Playing mass or something like this. Yeah. Woman want something for carnival Woman want something for carnival. Woman want something for carnival. They go in and get it for carnival. They go in and get it for carnival. DBS, 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 DBS. They go in and get him for carnival. Woman one pumping for carnival. Woman one pumping for carnival. Woman one pumping for carnival. They going to get it for carnival. DBS, 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 DBS. They going to get him for carnival. They going to get him for carnival. Okay, thank you. Play, play mass. This one by DBS and another one for mass 2022, 2023. Well, yes, sir. I, I like this one. Um, I like this one. Yeah, I like yes. this one. You know, it, it, can, it can have a sense of road match yes. as it develops, you know. Yes. Um, woman wants DBS for Carnival. Will DBS will be pumping, pumping for Carnival. <laughs> I, I really like that idea of the pumping for Carnival. One of my favorite Calypsonians, I must say. <laughs> I mean, I love his humor and um, I, lo I love what he brings to Calypso and he comes every year. And you know, he must be recognized for, for every sure, comment sure. with his humorous calypso. DBS never disappoints. <laughs> I, I'm Daryl T just corrected me that Spider made it to the final with going, Twice. Down, with going down slowly. Yes. So I just want to mention that they're sorry yes. for the mistake. Um, the, the song he did not go to the final with the mayor is a dog or something like that. The song was saying, Yes. Yes. And um, so we have the next Calypsonian that's coming on, this, on stage, Genius. And um, as if tonight I am not. Heard the masters of ceremony giving us the names of the songs because nice, you know sometimes worry. the names we'll are changing worry. when the Calypsonians come on stage. But this one, long. there's no name, uh, genius, and we know genius has been involved in the Calypsos for a number of years, you know. And um, off late, I've been hearing songs um, played on. Good days. evening, everybody. <laughs> Let's join genius on stage. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I, I think before we join on genius on stage, it looks as if the band has not gotten it yet, you know. He was actually helping Peter as to the melody that he's really waiting for, uh, would like to get. Well, I guess the rhythm. Okay. The, well, the rhythm, yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 He, yeah. Was, he, he maybe on the drum beat or something. No. But this guy has a lovely voice. Yes, he does. A melody, a sweet melodious nice voice, you know. And um, I, he used to be a, a part of Lucas Band. Yes, correct. Yes, you know. And he Lucas Band from Trafalgar. After, um, I think it was Hurricane um, Maria, he had, he had this big song. Yes. Dubai. Dubai. Not delegation, Dubai, not, delegation. Not, not the Calypso. He had, a, he had one right after Maria that made big waves. 
Okay, let's go on stage now for the genius. This one, political comment, political commentary, 
by Genius. Um, we know we just had an election just a few weeks ago, yes. and really speaking on the whole issue of electorates. Yeah. <laughs> well, I, I think that would have been a song that would have been more impactful if he had it out during the campaign. <laughs> <laughs> I, I heard this one, I mean, he did not do justice to it tonight, uh, but I heard this one yeah. on record, totally different, as Edgar said earlier on, mm. a guy with a very good voice, nice voice, yeah. uh, and tonight you, you realize that he did not even really bring it forth the way that he would, he would have liked it, and he asked the, he asked the band to let's take it a second time. Yeah. Yes, well, I think uh, he's a brave guy, you know, tonight. Um, I mean, I, that, that song, like a song for December 5th, you know, and um, but again, he's a calypso. He has lyrics, he has melody. The judges will decide. Well, we cannot say it's not relevant uh, because he dealt with the issues. I think uh, until the political commentary saying that labor um, is there, no one will take them out. Basically, yeah. But he's also asking in the song, "Give labor the vote." <laughs> well, so it goes yeah. something like a song yeah. for December fifth. Well, the next Calypsonian is uh, Niza. Let's go on stage for Niza. Hey, hey. I see in with society a doggy -e dog mentality. Everybody using somebody to be what they want to be. Seems nobody loves nobody. That is the reality. It's survival of the fittest. Concrete jungle, that's what it is. My dog, for a piece of meat. Child with child, for a bit of sweet. Shop and cheat customers for triple profit. Man rob that shop because he want to eat. Cop kick that teeth because he love to beat. So you see, all that for their benefit. Lies give the fans come, use you any way they can. Dog in dog in communities, dog in dog. Those who have want more, taking the lead from the poor dog in dog in society dog in dog it's a combat zone dog don't want to share no bone dog in dog in every country dog in dog one day predators will become prey they will get their turn in this dog in dog dog in dog world hey Peter they die they die Trapped in a system where we all are victims. Everybody fooling somebody. Money before humanity. It's the greedy, yes, of the greedy. In actuality, it's the law of the jungle for them ruthless people. Like to follow us comes naturally. Politicians take bribes, not fully. Lawyer rob clients with pen legally. Bossman use workers like it's slavery. You see, think only them to eat. Lies give thief and scam, use you any way they can. Doggy dog in communities, doggy dog. Those who have want more, taking the little from the poor. Doggy dog in society, doggy dog. It's a combat zone. Dog don't want to share no more. Doggy dog in every country, doggy dog. One day, predators will become prey. They will get their turn in this doggy dog, doggy dog world. Hey! Till I die. Well, Hunter, I can tell you, this one it reminds me of Tarina when she first came on stage many years ago, and I said Tarina is going to be a big Calypsonian. This young lady, this young lady, I repeat it myself, this young lady is somebody that we have to look out for. Dog eat dog, very well written, can catch up, 
and will catch up. Well, um, she reminds me more of Della. Remember Della? Yes. More than Tarina. I mean, Tarina is, I mean, an awesome singer. But she reminds she me is more. She's an awesome singer. Yeah, not, not like Tarina. She reminds me more I of Della. I said when Tarina first came on the scene. Yeah, but Tarina was always a good singer. Remember before she came to college, yes. she had won the, I think it was the flu or digital competition. One of them. <laughs> You know, um, so so um, Tarina is always a good singer, but she reminds me more but, of But tonight, she, she but did justice to her. Now let's go to the song song Trinity. Trinity has been singing bum, tonight. Bum, um, bum. No name. I have not, no name. Let's go and say for Trinity. Why? A CIA agent in Dominica On the phone with his supervisor Telling him how extreme Dominica has become This country were deep in Catholicism Today is your extremism Everybody talking about bomb As if it's nothing wrong Even children in school uniform They teaching children to make bomb boom boom Bomb bomb boom boom not all bomb does explode. They teaching children to make bomb, boom, boom, bomb, bomb, boom, boom, corrupting young boys and girls. America should be aware. Dominica is in bed with Syria, and the authorities don't seem to care. Keeps making you wonder if they're not there, undercover doing their share of bomb. Wait, why? Bum, 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 they make it bum. Wait, why? Two comedians on the radio soliciting young girls on their show. One from is a child and he's some just for an oral bum. I was on a bus heading into town. I made the bus driver put me down. When a woman entered to sit by his side, things died, so she decided she want to bomb a ride. Even them women does make bomb, boom, 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 boom. Not all bomb does explode. Even some parents does make bomb, boom, 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 boom. In bomb, they cook in their food. America should be how we are. Dominica is in bed with China. And the authorities don't seem to care. It's making you wonder if they're not there. Undercover doing their share of bomb. Wait, why? Boom, 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 they make it bomb. Wait, why? Thank you, thank you. See you at the quarters. Trinity! Pum, pum, See, pum. Trinity pum, with pum, one pum. Um, well, singing about yeah, making bomb. And I think just on that catchphrase alone, he is going to have a very popular, popular calypso for the season, uh, Mr. Joseph. And um, Trinity has always been one to push the envelope in, in his renditions. And I think this one here for the Calypso season 2023 is one that is going to leave a very impressive mark on the Calypso fans in general. Well, um, I agree with you, James. Um, very interesting Calypso. Play on the woods bomb. You know, and it's used to interpret it, what type of bomb. But, but, but all bomb... Um, um, then they explode. <laughs> <laughs> well, explode. like last year, he made one <laughs> talking about border. You before? Year before, year border. Year before. Right. So, so I, I think he has an interesting character, right. and I think he can go places this year. And yes. he said that he'll see him at the quarterfinals. And I hope so for his sake. <laughs> 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 well, the next kind of soda that we'll be having. Um, well, it looks like a mighty D. Yes, that's one stage, a mighty D. Sumbe. Sumbe. Oi. Oui. Pandemonium in the art of tongue. Pa la la la, pa la la. From a feisty, a tiny assembly. Pa la la la, pa la la. See, 
Dominican in me, Admiral Shin to see what's going on. In the center of the crowd, heated conversation, talking dogs. And I hear one say, I love my life in the air. And the other say, but just hush your mouth, day. You get all the bones, you not sharing none. Boy, just look at you with your fat bottom. All the other dogs who were looking on, just like a chorus, they all started barking. Who have, have, who do have, do have, who have, have, who do have, do have, who have, have, who do have, do have, who have, have, who do have, do have. Oh, my water sight could not believe my eyes, and everybody stood in awe, looking at talking dog. I go! Shume, Shume, Tidari do I, Shume, Shume, Oi! On the burning street, in the scorching heat. Balalala, balalala. More call, more to come. Road block in the tongue. Balalala, balalala. Some come around to incite them to doggies to fight for their own gain. Some try to calm down them peace, really hoping that peace will prevail. Then the first dog say, is none of your damn business. And the others say, them kind of chatters get to me. You are fancy house and you live in sweet. While my bed at night is the cold concrete. They say doggy dog, but you stretching it all in together. Them other dogs chanting, who have, have, who do have, do have, who have, have, who do have, do have. Have, have, who do have, do have, who have, have, who do have, do have. So hard to believe, yet so very true. No passerby could ignore the sight of talking dog. Hey! Shumbe, Shumbe. Tilani do I. Shumbe, Shumbe. Thank you, everybody. Mighty D. Coming from last year, Pauline, to this year, Talking Dog. And I can guarantee you, Edgar, that we are going to, when we hear dogs do, how, how, how. We're going to find out whether they say, who have, have, who don't have, don't have. What a creative piece of Calypso. That is from Jill. Yes. And I can Mighty D to me is one of the most improved Calypso yes. in Dominica. Very creative piece. Yeah. You know, and I can see the presentations there. I can see yes. the dogs on stage. <laughs> and, and, and even when he came, sorry, um, um, even when he came on stage, he did how, how, how. I started to wonder why until when the chorus came. James. Yes, and um, Mighty D, Mighty D has really improved, Edgar. And um, we we'll have to go back to the stage for the next Calypsonian. Mighty Jack. Mighty Jack. But one thing we must say that says we'll have to bring back Chester as mayor. <laughs> That's the second song about dogs, right? About dogs. <laughs> uh, this one is a real good one. Mighty Jack, he has been in the elimination before. Yeah, Never gone further. Let's go stage for the Mighty Jack. Coming through. Mighty Jack again. Aha. That neighbor of mine, she named Mrs. Pam. She do some farming. All in she backyard. She plant some cassava. She plant up some corn, when she plant the cocoa, it needs some water. You could hear she daughter, how she start to ball. Mm, 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 mm. Mommy pull the hose, to wet down the cocoa garden. Pull the hose, to wet down the cassava, to pull the hose. To wet up all the corn in there, pull the hose. What happened is first, you burst it. Mommy, you burst it. You burst it, burst it. You burst it. Mommy, you burst it. You burst it, burst it. Uh -huh. Come on. OK. 
Ok, boy. Aha. Things get so damn hard, so she went to financial. The minister tell her, go back to the soil. Again, she plant up some tanya. She plant up some yam. I hear she telling she daughter. She looking for kin. The woman love plenty kin. That is why she looking for kin. And the daughter balling. Mommy pull the hose to wet down the coco garden. Pull the hose to wet down the cassava. To pull the hose to wet up all the corn in the pull the hose. What happened is first, you burst it. Mommy, you burst it. You burst it, burst it. You burst it. Mommy, you burst it. You burst it, burst it. Bam, ba, da, hey! Thank you, thank you. Uh -huh. Yeah, 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 yeah. And we have, and you just heard from Mighty Jack, and um, with a uh, one saying about pull the hose. And Edgar, I think um, he was onto something there when he said that um, he wants to water the garden. Yeah. <laughs> it seems that the Calypsonians these days are all over. So we had some us up. Now yes. we're pulling the hose, <laughs> you know, so, so um, the sweet sauce up, now it's time to pull the hose to yes. water the garden, uh -huh. to, to grow the sauce up. Yeah, that's true, that's true. D yeah. DBS had played mass, remember this one? Yes. Uh, all right? Yes, <laughs> yes. Uh, so it's, a, it's another one, so that's like a fourth one for the night. Yeah. But I'm still the dog, um, the, the talking dogs. Talking dogs. I, I, yeah. I feel after to a great song by Mighty D. Yes. And I can kind of see him going places this year. For sure. The next Caledonian sure. food I... Um, we know that Fudai has been in this business for a very long time. Uh, so he's on tonight. He started way back in 1996. Uh, when he's, uh, in 1996, he sang Mumu Talking, but he came before that in the 80s. Fudai coming back after a long break. Yeah, he has been there for a very long time. And she used to write for him at the time. Yes. And I would like to hear what he's singing tonight, you know. Dressed all in black as usual. Let's go on stage for the Fudai. Tell me who are you and what do you do? Why spend so much of your time trying to make me blue? Where did you come from? What is going on? Why are you so much like a son of a gun? Give my life and energy to my country. Do all my way, never run overseas. So many years contributed to football academy But every move I make you see You send your bulldogs to hunt me It's like I don't have right to survive in my own country Like you want me kneel down and beg With me tail between me leg Like lazy bottom brain and the shining Zantoli You believe with all your money you could buy me then like an old motoka turn around and sell me Take no pleasure in embarrassing me Oh no For I know the Prince of Peace he walks beside me And reminds me he will never leave me hungry All I have to do is just to trust and serve me I know, but this pain in my heart, it is tearing me apart. Got to make a new start, need some help to do that. But like night must be today, this pain's bound to go away. And I will say, Messi Papa Poche. Oy, 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 oy. Boy, yo, yo, 
Tell me where you live. Why do you deceive? Why do you grab so much more than you can give? What's really your name? Or is it a game? Oh, how you've become such a national shame. In my life, you saw reason in this country. Always excel in every project given to me. Let the food force bring in Sina to this country. Soon as you got to know about me and where I worship in you see, it's like you want to choose my spiritual leader for me. So I must go down on my knees and say, Pope, help me please. Like them red caution, it take a lay in the DFC. You believe because you do not like my pastor. Somebody fool you and tell you you are my master. So I must bow to you for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Oh, no. There's one thing I want to remind you, my brother. Bow to his majesty and never to another. For only he alone can take away my dinner. I know. But it burning me to see this sad state of my country. Many seeing misery while a few just swimming in money. But with sun after the rain, new crops must sprout out again. So while it rain, I'm gonna bear my pain. Why, 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 why? 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 Thank you, thank you very much. The well, while it's elimination, we saw the seniority of the food eye. We know that in 1996, uh, he sang uh, No Mining, and in 1999, he sang Mumu Talking. Uh, tonight, uh, he sang one very much on the political side. Very much on the political side. I think he's um, trying to address somebody. and get an, I find it kind of long, though. And, you know, but you never know food eye can cross because he put down his song like a veteran of Calypso tonight. Well, the next character is Abia. Um, Abia has been in the business uh, uh, well, way back. Uh, about um, three, three years. Three. Yes, you yes. so correct. She started in, I think, 20, 2018, the about, yeah. 2020, yeah. the about, you know, uh, when she sang, um, no, she started in 2020, you're correct, uh, when she sang Message. And uh, tonight uh, she's here. And she's a different type of Calypsonian, you know. Yes. She, 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 she's very creative. Her melodies are different, you know. And Lyri lyrical the, content. I call her the David Rodder. Yes. Of Calypso. You know, and, she's and the even, female and, David Rodder. And, and even, even the, black, the black Stalin, uh, who just passed this week, Wednesday, you know, she, she has quite a lot of, of strong lyrics. Let's go on stage for Abia. with surprises things we see and hear say and do to each other a surprise is a feeling like when you lose your mother a surprise is a feeling like when you catch your lover this days in the commonwealth that's how we live things are happening that you would not believe surprising Surprise in Roseau, surprise in the Parliament, surprises from cabinet, surprise by surprise. That's the way we now live, brother. You would not believe. Surprise in the hospital, patients getting gone down. Surprise where Corona gone, her mandates are falling down. Surprise. Dominica surprise, we're living by surprise. Living by surprise. Huh. Time day, time day, day. Listen. Oh, 
what a feeling when you get catch by surprise. Hats racing, pumps sweating, ooh, your lips trembling. Who say they not in that? Cause they don't ready yet. Blue say they holding up the reform to ready yet. Big surprise when election call. I hear my boy's ball. That illegal at all. Who get catch of God? Who play the bad card surprise that we nearly get an independent government surprise? By surprise. That's the way we now live. Byron, you would not believe. Surprise in Marigot. Surprise in Bowie. Surprise where the billion gone. Brought to workers falling. Surprise. Dominica, surprise. We live in my surprise. Israel with a rendition surprise, Dominican surprise. And Edgar's such a beautiful voice, and um, she is basically letting us know that um, we can, we have to be prepared. We have to be prepared for anything, expect anything. And it's a, it's a really nice song, though I feel like she could have put a little bit more oomph into, into the deliverance. And I can agree with you, James. You know, if you're singing a song about surprise, she must catch us with some surprise. And I felt that um, a lot of use of the word surprise. Yeah. But with that beautiful voice, and I, I, I can see her crossing the line because, I mean, when it comes for delivery and that aspect, that helps a lot. You know, so far, in terms of the rendition, she's right on the rendition. Although it's not been judged tonight, I didn't see it. But the rendition helps the melody. And it also, you know, helped carry the message. And the next calypso on the stage is Royet, you know. She's a backup singer for the Swiggy Stars. So let's go take Royette something from Royet. Nice. Did I, did I? Did I, did I, did I? Yes, we care. All our goodness is they live in this service. How long can they stomach this foolishness? Yes, I know it's happening everywhere. But the red hair, none can compare. It took some young men with a gun to bring some attention to the things that's wrong. No security, no insurance rally, salaries so small can barely survive at all. No transportation to their destination, rain or heat, this is flagging pep in the streets. And they say, yes we care, got the staff not paid, Irish don't care, this is a paradox, time to put a stop. Put our health workers back at the top. They've had enough. Why? Why? Did I? Did I? Did I? Did I? Did I? Why? Why? Help how we miss DPMH days. Help China friendship is not friendly these days. We have all kinds of machineries. 
But patients still running for treatment overseas. Government ministers, they're not staying here. A helicopter for toothache, and they gone clear. Not even the PM taking any chances to make his children, he send his wife overseas. No security, no insurance rally. Salaries so small can barely survive at all. No transportation to their destination. Rain or heat, nurses flagging vep in the street. Then they say, yes, we care. Brato staff not paid. Irish don't care. This is the paradox. Time to put a stop. Put our nurses back at the top. They've had enough. Why? Why? Thank you. Royal. Riot, riot. Um, a young veteran, if I should say that, in the Calypso business. She has been around for quite some time as a backup singer in the Swingin' Stars band and occasionally as well um, putting her hat in the Calypso ring to bring a few renditions. And tonight she was, she's back again. And um, Edgar, Mr. Joseph, I, I feel like um, on this rendition, she was still trying to find herself with the song and as such didn't didn't present it in a, in a in a manner that i think that would have captured us in, in in some way well you see elimination sometimes do that to you or does that to you the reason for that is sometimes you've gotten a song about two weeks and then you have to think of cramming the song and remembering the melodies and uh, trying to ensure that you stay on cue um, Royette is a very good singer, uh, and tonight uh, you could sense this seniority of her through her voice. Uh, but you're right, um, James, in terms of she trying to catch herself and to ensure that you're able to deliver. Well, um, she's singing a, a serious message. She wants to put this back on top. But I felt as James that um, in terms of her rendition, as a, a singer, I expected more from her. Yeah. And uh, it's, it's still a song that has to go on me. I still have to listen to that song a little more closer, closely. Yes. And the melody is not very flowing, you know? Right, right. And we are on stage now. Um, White Ferry, set on stage. Cross the bridge. Yeah. Ding, 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 ding. I wish more people would be just like me. Outspoken yet, not fighting nobody. But oh no, we are all different. We may have same plans to build our own destiny. Build our homes, live our dreams, enjoy life free. But the path we may take may not be the same. Our liberty is what it is. It's dog eat dog or rat it cheese. No survival depends on our financial status. Nobody wants to be hungry. Under depression, no one's B.I.G. And there comes vulnerability. Where money will bring even the biggest man to his knees. So jump police, jump sonic, boom, jump fire, go cross the bridge. Your fans would dance, they would enjoy the beat. But it's you who was in the kitchen, feeling the, the heat, brother, the heat. Che, 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 da, 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 da. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. White fairy again. Ding, dun, dun, dun. The Bible say, oh no, the hands that feet. And if you're left and do you wrong, caught it. But in these rough times today, the elevens have to stay. You can bring a donkey to the river to feed. Victimize it, leave in hell for it to take a drink. But if that donkey refrains, 
Respect the donkey say. Every man, oh man, wants to succeed. Build a big mansion and plenty to eat. Without that big short lifestyle today, for some frustration gets its way. There are principles in everything. Working for government or selling weed. So at once, law is when church leaders they backslide instead. Just for the money. That is the order of the day. So jump preacher, jump pastor, jump prophet, go cross your bridge. Your congregation will cry, pastor you left us dry. But it's you who was not seeing the prophet, who feeling the heat, the heat, pastor the heat. Dominical, Jim, White Ferret, the White Ferret. Hey, right. And that was White Ferry, um, Edgar, Mr. Joseph, with one. I, I didn't catch the, the, the title of the song that he sang. Did, um, did any of you catch it? Well, I didn't see the title, but um, I, I think it's Cross the Bridge. Cross the Bridge. Yes. Yes, that's I it. That's I, it. I, I think that's Cross the Bridge, is yes. The, yes, the title of the song. Uh -huh. uh, a very interesting song. Um, it has a nice road match kind of vibe to it. I am still following. I was trying to yeah. follow the progression of the Calypso. I didn't get it um, too clearly, because, but um, I think with time it will grow on you. But it has a really nice bounce. Yes. Really good for the road. And I expect White Ferry to do some damage with this one this year. Yes, and um, and uh, for those of us who know White Ferry and the, the type of songs that he brings across, it's usually some up tempo type of vibe. So it def definitely has potential to to be a road match song. And um, I'm sure that as the season um, goes on, it will it will get stronger, and the delivery of that song will be even better um, from White Ferry for what we know him to be. Yeah, and when you see when you put the arrangement around it and everything else, yeah, you know it it will definitely sound better. And you know he has a wonderful voice yes. and he can deliver That's that correct. type of song. So yeah. I expect him to grow as the season progresses. Yes, I agree. I agree to that uh, as well. And uh, as the MC Dice King Dice is saying, the show continues with the next Calypsonian. And the next question is supposed to be Ace. Ace. Yeah, I think he's saying that is my song. Yes. I think I heard that song somewhere. This is my song. This is my song, right? Yeah. Uh, yeah that is my song. Yeah, I think I heard it somewhere. <laughs> but and we'll take Ace you on, stage. on the stage. Good evening, judges. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Good evening, Kaip So! You don't know! It's at the council! 2023! Brand new thing! Boy, boy! Now it's so, so, so! Been some years at your upon that mission In the Calypso grind Composing all my rendition Singing what's up current time but it seems that I top this top selection But making headways, not gaining play I'm left with so many options But we'll bend in me right in style Cause that is my song Who vexed them, lost them wrong I know Calypso have light But this is my contribution That is my song I sing in unusual grounds It's not about looks and likes It's Calypso competition let all the wicked backstabbing Please come to an end And let the best performer win Not because of friend Oh, let the best performer win Oh, let the top performer win Oh, let the best performer win The top among the ten Hit me! Calypso! For so! So full of lions and dragons, snakes, wolves, and polar bears. 
seen of some situation Shedding crocodile tears So wanna hear about confrontation In this Calypso administration Who gonna sing about them concerns? This Calypso melody Cause that is my song Who vet them, lost them wrong We having cat and dog fight This is Calypso competition That is my song I sing in on neutral ground no kumbaya social night, this is Calypso litigation. So let all the wicked backstabbing, please come to an end and let the best performer win. Not because of friend, oh let the best performer win. Let the top performer win, oh let the best performer win. The top among the ten. We're done now, enjoy the rest of the show. Yes. And, and we had Ace, Ace with this one. Um, he was very brief, Edgar, in, in, in his presentation of the song. Well, as you know, Ace by the name of Dr. Al Kazimi, a mm -hmm. uh, big agriculturist in the country, very intelligent. I'm Dominican, you know, has a lot of ideas. Yes. You know, and um, it's very good when you can have somebody for doctorate in Calypso. So we have to big up Al for that. Yes. Um, is as his Calypso name is, and um, that is his song. <laughs> yes. You know, let the best performer win. I agree. You know, so maybe I, I sometimes I wonder if that is my song or let the best performer win. Says him. <laughs> I would call it let the best performer win. Yeah. I I I'd, I'd rather that theme because it is surrounding. You know given the theme of um, the songs that have been sung, his dissatisfaction, and, and so let the best performer win would be a more, not catchy, but a more appropriate, topical, a more appropriate, yeah, a more appropriate, appropriate theme, um, yeah. theme yeah, or uh, title. because of the song that you're actually singing, you know. Yeah. But you that is his song. You, you, that, but that is his song. Yeah, that is his song. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so we have the next Calypsonian that is coming up. Um, son of the Saint, you know, Son of the Saint himself has been around for a number of years. And um, you remember that he started way back in 2001, a long time ago, you know, some 20 years ago, 21 years ago. Um, so he's a senior in the Calypso business. And he's known for one of his big songs, um, Wrong Foot and also Gallon Bottle. Yes. Sir. He made the finals of these two big ones. You know, so let's join some of the saints on stage. Ah, boy. Yes, sir. Last year, there was a surgeon in the coco. Them fellas, not for days, to purchase coco in different ways. But today, I come here to say, I have a brand new product on the way. And it comes in the form of your favorite livestock. Ladies, I am not your selling cock. I selling cock. I sell in cock, uh, I sell in cock, uh, fully, I sell in cock, I sell in black cock, fat cock, jagger or frizzy, I have them boilers too, long cock, strong cock, I tell you, I have the best cock in town, hey, oh tío, mama, <laughs> you like, I like, Ladies, come from the rampa to see some chicken from my abattoir. Early in the morning, if they want to buy, I have no problem making my cock rise. An exchange is no robbery. You can trade your cocoa for local poultry. And if you wish to battle for land house or money, best you go state house or the ministry. I tell in cock. I sell in cock, uh, uh, I sell in cock, uh, fully. I sell in cock, I sell in red cock, white cock, shaker and fizzy. I have them boilers too, long cock, short cock. I tell you, I have some coden in talk. Hey, papa da 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 da
Well, Edgar for sure tonight. I am not selling short cock. I'm selling red long cock tonight. I love this one. <laughs> selling cock. Well, it is C-O-C-K. Selling cock. <laughs> Whatever you call it, cock. You Good evening, cock. Duncan. Good evening, Cecil. Good evening, Edgar. Good evening to the listeners of DBS Radio. Hard question. Uh, what cock are you selling? Um, well, I'm not sure because um, what is the spelling of that one? Because um, C O C K. C O C K. Well, yeah. obviously it's a pun, and um, we, he's spinning right through a very beautiful song, nicely written. Yes. And uh, of course, it's open for um, your interpretation. Well, I, mask. I just wanted to say something, Duncan. It remind, reminds me. Remember when Singing Sun just sing um, "Crying in the Ghetto"? Yes. And then somebody responded, "They laughing in the ghetto." I well, love I love what he di he did with that you know uh, that last year I miss you selling cocoa this year he's selling cock correct you know <laughs> and, and, and it's good a, work. a clear storyline for yeah. those of of you who've been listening and following Calypso in Dominica if you followed what happened last year there was a very explosive song um, called Coco um, it could have made it up um, higher up on the, on stage she was overloaded on stage and of course um, she fell flat. And um, this time around, um, well, son of the scene too, we know, um, can pull it off when he has good material. And he does have good material this year. So it's a big year for him. I'm hoping through that he gets through to the next round. And um, like wrong foot, he did right foot in the wrong I, I shoes. Wonder, I wonder, Duncan, if your pen went on to... Are uh, the white paper of um, Son of the Saints? Uh, no, I no, no, I no, know, no, I know that you're his uncle. Yes, I'm his uncle, but but I was not involved in that one. Um, I um, I certainly was not in. I was not cocking on this cock. You're very cocky, Duncan. Uh, well, that's what Calypso is all about, you know. It's an editorial in song of the life that we undergo. Well, the next Calypso then is the founder. We know that the founder has some long. First verses or second verses. Well, the thunder is full of thunder. And it's, well, it's <laughs> going to be, it's going to give us some thunder tonight. Yeah. I really want to find out what he's going to be singing tonight. Let's join thunder. <laughs> Everyone, I feel good. You don't have the spectators. You don't have to waste tonight. The Lord of us come to you. The first man, the red of the red of the red of Let's go. It's all up, bro. So it's just demonstrate and demonstrate. You just demonstrate. Yeah, be well. One Sunday evening, I say, Is we my dreaming? Is we my dreaming? Is we my dreaming? Is we my dreaming? I dream in Buffet in his grave talking to me and telling me is there that is pencil in town? The UWP of Ojo sing leader inside of Dominica. They didn't do nothing at all. They didn't work in at all. It just violated in the law and causing so much trouble and damage inside the Rosso and Dominica and just demonstrate and demonstrate. So he tell me it's their self. It's their self. The only pirates in the history book, those the pirates in the Caribbean, is there now the pirates inside of Dominica? They didn't do nothing at all. They didn't work in at all. It was violating the law and causing so much trouble. They it's a rose of Dominica and just demonstrate for what? And just demonstrate. So much demonstration is just demonstrate and demonstrate. It's just demonstrate and demonstrate. That's what the bad man is just demonstrate. And demonstrate, just demonstrate, and demonstrate. Hi, yeah, 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 it's my day, my day. It's my day, my day. Yeah, well, a lot of them went to school. 
Then I go forward, neither backward. Then I go left, or even right. What the friend who said, the I said, what the bros I said, it's not dead matching. It's not dead matching. It's not dead matching. So he tell me, it's their self. It's their self. There was only pirates in the history book. There was only pirates in the Caribbean. So he's there as the pirate instead of Dominica. They didn't do nothing at all. They didn't work it at all. He don't find out the law has caused so much trouble to me. He said, Rosie and Dominica and just demonstrate for what? So the demonstration is just demonstrate and demonstrate. He's just demonstrate and Demonstrate. That's when the best man is just demonstrate. Good night to each and everyone. I see all the next kind of competition. Good night to each and everyone. Just demonstrate. Just demonstrate. demonstrate. And demonstrate. demonstrate. Just demonstrate. And demonstrate. And go on your walk. Yeah, go on your walk on Wednesday and demonstrate. <laughs> that is what I'm telling you. Yeah, let, you know. me, let me tell you. Let me Demonstrate, demonstrate. Talking about situations on a on a Wednesday, uh, he tried to put it in song. Edgar, he's just demonstrate and demonstrate. That's all for me. Demonstrate, demonstrate. They're the just matching lovely it. Lovely beat and the demonstrate is a nice hook. <laughs> I like that. Yeah. Like so that. there's he just a nice hook. And, and maybe we could ask the people who are doing the demonstration to use that one on the Wednesdays so that they can actually be able to chip. Demonstrate, demonstrate. They just matching in Rosso. Rosso Dominica, demonstrate, demonstrate. They just demonstrate. What about you, um, my good brother, Sto? Yeah, very different though. Um, we know that he's a different and, on, and um, he has his own style. And of course, you have to follow the man's style. Um, he's writing, he's rhyming, he's rapping in his Calypso um, um, delivery and He's someone, at least, who I think we can say he has, he has improved. Because at least once upon a time, um, you, you were wondering where was he going to start, where was he going to stop. But clearly he ended. So he, he had a beginning, he had a middle and an end. And um, he carried us through some of the history books um, and in terms of the piracy. And so very interesting way he was able to put his music together. Well, with the next character and Hixie, who started way back in 1976, I should say, got the crown at the... Um, um, Stardom Tent for the ver first Calypsonian um, to receive a, a, a Stardom Tent uh, way back in 1976, the Hixie. He's on stage. He's going to give us what tonight? Day running. Day running. I would like to hear this one. Let's go on stage. Yes, I. Yes, I. Bring it. That the authorities is ignoring them To make it a thing All they do is wrong thing And they have them doing all this thing again Mama muete tu zuti mwe Si ipani suti we Ipani pies pole Let's stop this situation Stop creating a society of criminal delinquents Cause when all is said and done And retribution comes around When it comes You should see them running You should see them running You should see them running When their time coming You should see them running Oh my God, they're running You should see them running When their time coming and when their backs are against the wall As the fire and brimstone fall From the wrath of their victims All they can do is ball And ball, and ball They running, they running Oh my God, they running When their time coming They running, oh my Lord They running Oh my God, they running when their turn coming. Hit the horn. Ten, five, me. 
Yes, I. Renee. Ep, 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 ep. I pray, Lord, I pray, and I hope that one day that the powers that be will devise a plan to work assiduously to free up this country from the ravages of crime that is a crazy way. Brother Rusey always say, these are the signs of the times. Jebe, jebe, lache. But what they doing here today, everyone will find a way and they'll get it on there. So let you have a strong well, when retribution comes, when it comes, you should see them running. You should see them running. You should see them running. When their time coming, you should see them running. Oh, me God, they're running. Oh, me Lord, they're running. When their time coming, and when their backs are against the wall, as the fire and brimstone fall from the wrath of their victims, all they can do is fall. And ball, and ball, they're running. Oh, my God, they're running. Oh, my Lord, they're running. When their time coming, you should see them running. Oh, my Lord, they're running. Oh, my God, they're running. When their turn coming, hit the horn. Oh, then me. Ep, 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 bring Yes, I. Ep, 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 ep. Thank you very much. Exit. Uh, gentlemen, I, I, I might need some help there because I was trying to follow the narrative on that on that one. Hicks Ibino has been around for many years and he has written many songs. And, and he has written very good songs too. Um, um, for some reason, I don't know, he always chooses one that um, I guess gets you thinking and, 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 and sometimes um, have you struggling to follow uh, um, especially the connections and the narrative of the, the verses into into the various lines and um, at the end um, what exactly it is um, he's trying to capture there. What, while he was singing um, Duncan, I said the same thing, you know. Um, what about Hixi is that um, every year his songs actually once it passes one line, you then start to get the development of that song. But I think um, it sometimes takes too long to really get it. Um, but this one for sure, I have to listen to it a few times again to really find out what he's actually talking about the running. Well, I find his song a little futuristic that, you know, he, he's, he's saying that when retribution comes, basically, that um, people will be running, you know, for, you know, they'll be under pressure, basically. You know, whoever doing whatever is wrong. But to me, he's a typical type of Exicalypso. You know, it's, it's, it's talking a, a same trend, same type of Exicalypso. And I find Duncan, I don't know if you picked that up, but I find his rendition kind of suffering a bit these days. Yes, yes, yes. I guess maybe Edgar, something like Short Shirts, the fire coming after. Yeah. So the next Calypso on stage is Walks Up singing the B. Aha! Uh -huh. Hey! My lady, be for a fool. She says she's on the floor. She says, Walks Up, I want something hot, hot, hot. Hot, 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 hot. Like a bottle of cannabis wine in a hand. Hot, 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 hot. And he's singing, from talk is a bee, and he's singing everybody. Hey, from talk is a bee, and he's singing everybody. Hey, from talk is a bee, and he's singing everybody. Hey. I want my feeling, my cannibal feeling. I want my feeling, my cannibal feeling. Come again, box up, box up, two wine. 
รีบไว้ปล่อยไว้ตั้งไว้สิ่งสวยสบายสิ่งสวยนั่งไว้อันที่สิ่งนี้บอกเจ้ากินแบบนี้อันที่สิ่งนี้เนี่ยพี่บอกดีบอกเจ้ากินแบบนี้อันที่สิ่งนี้เนี่ยพี่บอกดีเฮ้ยสิ่งนี้มันอะไรสิ่งนี้มันอะไรสิ่งนี้เซนเตอร์ All over your body, walk so fit and be. I'm singing to everybody. Hey, walk so fit and be. I'm singing to everybody. Hey, pa 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 la pa, pa pa la pa pa la pa pa. Hey, pa 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 la pa, pa pa la pa pa la pa pa. Hey, hey, hey. Give me that, give me my feelings. Send me to give me my feelings. Send me to give me my feelings. I need to buy my feelings more. I need to buy more. I need to buy my feelings more. I need to buy more. What's up, Mr. B? I need to give everybody. Hey. What's up, Mr. B? I need to give everybody. Hey. What's up, Mr. B? I need to give everybody. Hey. I want my feeling. I want my feeling. I want my feeling. I want my feeling. I can't stop feeling. I'm talking to me and it's singing to everybody. Hey, I'm talking to me and it's singing to everybody. Hey, la 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 la. Yeah man, everybody alright? Yeah man, singing. B, B, B. Sing like a B. Sing like a B. Singing, singing. Don't talk to me. I need to give everybody. Hey, 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 hey. That, 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 yeah, that was well, the well. walks up there, former road match um, king. Many times road match king in Dominica. How many times, Cecil? Three times road Three match times king. Three times road match king. For the sure. walks up. A Tomato very is one. bouncy, beautiful beat there. Something that certainly could be developed into a road match. It reminds me of the, the song by, by Griner out of Barbados. I think it was Griner or Gabby? Um, Gabby, um, Edgar, I think it's Griner that sang um, the Stinging Bees. Um, a very, very, um, it was popular back in its days. Gabby. And Gabby, okay, it was Gabby. Okay, but I think Griner had a B too. Um, so maybe Griner and Gabby, but I know there was a B out of Barbados. And um, that song definitely, with proper lyrics and nice and um, a little bit, a little bit of effort and development, could make it big on the road in Dominica. Well, remember, um, Gabby Owen was about the political, eh? Remember well, the it, idea? Yes, 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 yes. Yeah, but um, as uh, my problem with Walks Up, he used to get help from people like Peter Lita. I think he needs help, you know, in terms of develop because he he has a nice little hook, the B and sting in everybody. You know, you need to now play around that hook nicely. You know, and as you say, it, it, it can make a good road match, but they just need to do some work around it nicely. You know, some nice simple lines again, and it'll be nice. But, but while we're saying this, there's some people that we know that we are not prepared to see that type of lyrical content that we are talking about. They are really here just to amuse and to make us just sing the hook. And the hook tonight is, walk talk is a bee, and I'm singing everybody. But you he, you, he can, you can't expect could, DBS to do better. He could extend it and call all the other Calypsonians, Dice is a B, and he's stinging everybody. Yeah, right. Yeah, and he could fix it up like that, you know, and even bring it in the political realm, you know, and and um, call some of the politicians. The in. next Calypsonian is Trilla Dree. Let's go on stage. Wait, you mean no? I don't want airport no more. I try and murder my hopes. Sire is a ship we build in to take us where we want to go. <laughs> we hired a famous boat builder by the name of Dick Taylor, and he start laboring way back in 04. And soon we will sail the seas, the entire world will freeze when they see we mountain a Dick Taylor ship all along. So if you 
want to party and forget all your worries. Say all aboard, all aboard. And if you want to know where well, they give you not free money, say all aboard, all aboard. We mountain a ship, dictatorship. No more leadership, only dictatorship. We sell the citizenship for the dictatorship. My 2026 is dictatorship. And we will sail away from democracy on a dictatorship. Wait, we made it by me. Wait, 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 thriller on the mind in Calypso. Wait, dictatorship looking nice, but. Some workers don't like his designs. Well, all who want to protest can do it. All the policemen on his side. <laughs> that sheep have all gangs, two banks, and two radio stations, and fuel from Petro Caribe. That sheep have water and lights, and a fearless captain. We just hope the captain to reset his crew again. So if you want to party and forget all your worries, say all aboard, all aboard. There's room for everybody except for them shabba. We say all aboard. My 2026 is dictatorship, and we will sail away from democracy on a dictatorship. Wait, wait, me me de ba wait, wait. Wait, thriller on the mic in Calypso. Wait, thank you, everybody. Thriller G. Well, well, well. This is a big one for 2023. I can say clearly this one is going to semi finals. This is well written, well masked, and really and truly, the senior Calypsonians should take on board that concept. Duncan. And it's a very well written song. I mean, the concept is uh, nicely developed. It would be interesting to hear how it goes and develops further with the other three, four verses, maybe five, I don't know. But clearly, I mean, the use and the employment of the figurative devices here are really, really incredible, Edgar. Well, that's the creativity of the act we have been asking for, Duncan. You know that not just write a straight song, but you can... This is called political commentary done in a very, very good way, very artistic way. You know, and I just want to speak about Trilogy. Trilogy is a Buyo artist. Very, yes. Very popular Buyo artist. And it's, it's very good to see that he has come into Calypso and, not only that, and coming in a big way. And not only that, last year we saw Rich himself, another Buyo artist, came in there and already created a real, a real wave. And I'm sure that um, this one with Trilogy was written by him. And the Bouillon single artists really, if they're coming to this big stage, they are prepared for it. And the next one will be Big, big Jeff. Um, big Jeff will be singing tonight, I'm not so sure. But um, we just heard Trilogy, and this one, Duncan and Edgar, really will resonate in my mind. It resonated well with me too, and that's what you call Calypso. When you hear these things at the end, you say Calypso, Calypso. And, we, and, and I'm prepared to hear this one in the semi finals. Um, this is going to go far. Uh, Cecil is very busy here, Duncan. No. We have to go for rungs, and you have to perform your song well, well, before you make it to the next one. Well, I am saying to you, based well, on what I, I saw I, I, I'm sure at, it's at, at the quarterfinals, I'm sure it's going to the quarterfinals. Based on what I saw at the, at the eliminations, that is going to be... In the quarterfinals, In the quarterfinals. Sure. It's going to wreck the, wreck the crowd that's going to be there, and it's going to go straight into semi-finals. Once he does, prepared to say that. Once he does it well, I think he can make it to the finals too, but we must hear everybody else's song. Well, I understand that, but we're, we're talking about a sat satire, masking, and the use of words, tonight we saw this from, from Trilogy. And I concur. Right. And um, Buyo artist, a young Buyo artist, last year, as I said, we saw um, Rich. I'm disappointed that I didn't see him this year, but the fact is another Buyo artist came in and replaced him. And I just want to speak about Trilogy. I've been following Trilogy for a while. And Trilogy is, has always been very lyrical. That's what I like about him as a Buyo artist. You follow the kind of, of work he does. He's very, very, very lyrical. So that's why he could come and do that. I and, think and, and that is why the very first time I, I, I played a Buyo song of Trilogy, did not know who the person was. And I tried my best to see and to know who he was. When I found out who he was, found out who his parents were, I was very much elated to know that this type of 
music could come from trilogy in terms of the lyrical contents. He had something like something like prayer. Yeah. And it's really a serious I queer pray. song. Yeah. I pray. A wonderful, wonderful, well written song with nice melody, nice lyrics. Represented but, his friend. Yeah. And, and, and he's a very popular young artist. Eh? Very, 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 very popular. So I can, is, there, is there a reason, gentlemen, why that level of creativity and um, composition and, um, well, if you want to put lyrics, um, can't find its way in the Bouillon music? Well, it's happening, no, no, you know, if you follow yeah. um, Signal Band. Well, I forget Signal. Signal uh, is at a level. Trilogy, 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 well, SI is very Trilogy good. Yeah. Reach, reach to a certain extent, you know, and you have a number of, of the individual um, Buyo artists themselves who are actually reaching that stage. I agree of, with that. Of I giving, agree with that. Of giving good lyrics. But know? I'm talking, uh, I mean, I'm, sp I'm speaking a block. I mean, the, the, from the wider, from a wider perspective. But I think it's our DJs that have to help us. I think they like to promote the simple ones. And we are, we are vigilante on stage now. And vigilante, those of us who know vigilante, vigilante would have started way back in yeah. the year I think uh, 2020. Let's join Vigilante on stage. Hey, 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 hey. Ha. Hear the innocent crying through the night. I can hear their lament as justice refused to bite. Murderers walk free, molesters get leniency. Victims go through hells. Living in mental cell like criminality is our new commodity. We produce in this society. I is George. I is New justice system, new society, where lawyers can talk and criminals walk. For those who bled, for those who shed tears, for the going to dead, oh, the guilty will be held. Spider's way in the spider's way. Yes. Hey, 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 hey. Democracy on democratic, this guy's dictatorship, freedom no longer free. When servants victimize freely, majority create chaos. They want power by force, minority abusers. They won't keep office at all costs, inherit white man politics. Those who want an old office, we mean we for gimmicks. Breathing self interest. I is George. I is Jure. New justice system, new society, where lawyers can talk and crooked politicians talk. Electorism is misled and reach yourself instead, whether blue or red. Oh, the guilty will be held. Spider's way in the spider's way. Yes. Thank you very much, everyone. Hey, 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 hey. Vichy, 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 long day. The spider's web. Kaizo. 
Very Are you having a piece there from the vigilante? Something in he calls Spider's Web. Um, I would have um, loved to have been able to see the web uh, weaved a little um, clearer, um, but um, I, I think um, uh, certainly there is room, some room for, for development of the web at it, as it weaves um, through the calypso. Yes, I was just thinking the same thing, Duncan, that I mean, um, interesting song, I mean, the serious message that we, our, our society have to look at. You know about justice, you know, and ensuring that the victim get justice. But as you say, I mean, the spider web. He should have created, use language, use figurative language to create that web. You know. Well, well, maybe guys, um, we only get in two verses and two choruses. If there are three more, he may just develop it in that way that we are thinking about. So it's elimination, and I believe um, we may just get what we are actually asking for. Uh, we will see the well, the thing about me for development, I, 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 I like to follow the journey from the beginning and it needs to take me from, I, I, I know we, we need a, a third verse, a uh, fourth one, but for now, I still, you know, and I, what the other thing I find about him is that he likes to be in that same mood all the time, yeah. that lamentation. Yeah, when he started in 2006, kind of, yeah. knows um, yeah. he has not changed that lamentation. In that lamentation then. mood, you know. I think they, you remember when he did that. Um, I think it was um, dollar, the dollar, dollar man. Dollar, yeah. yeah, he need to get back into that kind of, you know, because he has that good energy. He has a wonderful voice, you know. But he's stuck in that. And for him at to come the time, after the trilogy there. At the time, Pat Aaron actually wrote for him, so I'm not too sure who is his writer now. Yeah, I think this one was written by Pale I'm John Baptist, if I, if I to be, if I, if I'm correct. It's very different, though, from what um, the material that Pat gave him. Clearly, um, Pat has that um, uncanny ability to to create stuff to fit the the, the head and the, the the body and the soul um, of the the presenter. And um, clearly, I don't think um, that type of um, presentation suits the vigilante very well. I would um, like to see Tim Jura himself, who who almost um, helped in terms of some good singers. And presenters of songs, um, maybe to maybe write for him, you know, and that would really help him. To even Bassi, uh, or oh, even Bassi. Uh, but well, the, I think the next artist has been announced, um, and the next artist will be Black Diamond. Let's go on stage for the Black Diamond. Shuba Dubai. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. That day, that day. That day, day, day. I give it. I found myself on a plane straight to England to attend an old lady's funeral. It's my granny that gave me her invitation. She don't like to travel at all. My granny said, please follow my instructions. Make sure you find that old lady son. Offer my sympathy for his dear mommy. But please remind him, she's still owing me. So Charlie, my granny asked me to tell you that you have to pay for what your parents do. We did that that day, oh in she, for more than a century. And no effort has been made to ensure the balance is paid. And Charlie, my granny thought that you should know that you have to pay for what your parents owe For the pain and the misery Abuse and brutality I hope you don't find it strange But I come for my granny change I give me Till and day Shuba Dubai I give me that day My granny family was taken from 
Africa. Forcefully sold by her own brothers. Defiant ones who refused to make the journey. Jumped off the boats and drowned in the sea. Some of them were taken to North America to work in the cotton fields over there. While others were brought over to the Caribbean to slave on the sugar cane plantation. So Charlie, my granny asked me to tell you that you have to pay for what your parents do with the debt that they owe in she for more than a century. And no effort has been made to ensure the balance is paid. And Charlie, my granny thought that you should know that you have to pay for what your parents owe. For the hurt and the injury, the shame and indignity. I hope you don't find it change, but I come for my granny change. I give it! Shuba Dubai. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. It's been a pleasure. Daddy. This one is a big one. Daddy. Talks about King Charles, uh, the King of England. Uh, talking about reparation. Talking about the Caribbean and his slave trade. I would like to hear the conclusion talking about Dominica. Well, um, it is about reparation. And I, I know Dr. D I want to dedicate that song to Dr. Dublin and the reparation committee for the work they're doing. And everybody else who's done something about reparation. It is a big calypso. It is a different topic. You know, dealing with a different issue, and you know, we have our new King Charles and the writer, I guess, maybe Joey Lloyd. Good work by Joey Lloyd. And again, I mean, look at the vessel. This guy, I mean, this voice. This is a true Calypso voice, you know, and the way he delivers material. You hear every word, you know, really big rendition by the Black Diamond. Clearly, a lot of thought went into the production of this one. Um, you have to give your or tip your hat to this, this, um, the writer of this one, the way um, they went about doing the, the delivery of the request for reparation. I'd like to say a pleasant good evening to my friend Ali Gill. And Ali is involved in the reparation movement of out of Grenada. And um, I know Ali, who is an ardent Calypso fan, has written uh, um, extensively on Calypso and follows Calypso, would certainly like to hear that one in its entirety. Oh, for sure, because, you know, talking about the reparation, as we said earlier on, Edgar, and talking about Charlie, the King of England, and coming to from Dominica to a funeral is a good way to really tell the story, you know, and, 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 telling, the, and telling the story about your owing us. Very good development, that's what you're saying. Very, very, very good development. Who's next? The next Calypsonian will be Mystery. Rampage, rampage, rampage. Call 911 to stop the jam we a mystery woman causing havoc in the party, the party. 911 was not enough, they had to call a special force. Even WhatsApp, the minister of security. Breaking news, 
breaking news. Hulk Alai, Q and Kyrie, tell GBS for me. Immigration trying to deport me. Whoa! Yes. Well, they thought it was a tornado and erupt in a volcano. It was mystery lady on a rampage, rampage. The way the place vibrating, everybody dancing. This African beauty on a rampage, on a rampage. Last year, Coco Stick was a hit. Ha! This year, I double in it. So, si ou pa ni bon pied. Veyou la, pou mwen danse. Veyou la, pou mwen amise. Veyou la, avan si se sonne. Pou mwen danse kole. Woy! Don't know why we shy you why the paparazzi launching an attack, a fatal attack on mystery, mystery as I draw to the valley. I see my destiny. But I'm well armed, focused, and dangerous. Dangerous. My head is on. I feel it strong. Let them come. Tell them to come. Who have eyes will see. Who have skin will feel. Why? Well, they thought it was a tornado and erupting volcano. It was mystery lady on a rampage, rampage. The way the place vibrating, everybody dancing. This African beauty on a rampage, on a rampage. Last year, Coco Stick was a hit. Why? This year, I double in it. So si ou pa ni bon pied, ve you la pou mwen danse, ve you la pou mwen amise, ve you la avan si se sonne pou mwen danse kole. Woy! Rampage, on a rampage, 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 on a rampage. Rampage, 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 on a rampage, 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 rampage. Thank you, everybody. Miss, Miss. The mysterious lady, the lady called Mystery. Um, I was wondering as she developed the lines whether she was speaking about a real incident but i realized um it was just something that the the writer was just imagining and um it's really um imaginative lyrics there um of course uh, it, it is something that could happen you know when you 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 have uh, ufos and is it a, a real a, a real thing or is it something that people imagine and um, very interesting way they developed. I'm not sure if she's going to create a rampage this year with that one. I think Coco Stick, um, the bar of Coco Stick was so high that it's very difficult to duplicate. But she's hoping that this year she can duplicate. Gentlemen, can this one create a rampage? Well, we'll have to wait and see, um, Duncan. But uh, I, I noticed that, um, you know, like, that happened to a lot of Calisonians. That you came with a big hit the year before. And then you expect it to reach the same standard like last year. And I think uh, Mystery is suffering a little bit from that. But I think this song can grow. I think it has the potential to grow. You know, and I hope she can cross the line and as, uh, as I'm to the quarterfinals. And from there, she can, the song can keep going. It has a nice little bouncy beat, a nice little party vibe to it, you know, and a nice little carnival flavor. So I hope it can grow for her, her sake. Because I mean, last year she did so well. You know, so I would like to see her make some progress. 
We really wish you the best this time around. But the competition is very tight so far. Huh? It is a tight competition tight, this year. Yeah. Yeah. And what I like most, Duncan, you see that although we have the same the political topics, but we also have a number of Calypsonians um, singing on some new topics, which, which, which is very nice for the Calypso. A lot of imagination has gone in there this year. On stage, I can't make out the next artist. Oh, that's Joy. Um, well, she goes by the name of Joy. And um, we know Joy Stout. And I, it looks like Joy Stout to me. Yes, it the is. The Joy. Okay, then. So we have to go on stage for one of our artists who is now in the Calypso business, Joy. How are y'all feeling tonight? Mm. Just something sweet for you. And listen. Mm. As you get older, you have to be wiser. Know who in your corner, know who at your shoulder. This makes them hiding, hiding, hiding in the dark. This makes them hiding, hiding, waiting to attack. In this life, you got to be wise. Never contribute to your own demise. You listening, right? I am not afraid of the words of my enemy. As much as I concerned about the silence of my friends. I am not afraid of the words of my enemy. As much as I concerned about the silence of my friends. Cause your enemy take no chance. He go maintain his distance. Yes, the enemy with one glance, you go see his disappearance. But your friends, they go sit with you, uh-huh. They go eat with you, uh-huh. They go laugh with you, and uh, when they done, 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 they dagger you afraid by the words of my enemy. As much as I concerned about the silence of my friends. Oh, you hear me? I want to hear your scream. You agree with me, Dominicans? Ah. Listen, there are those among us, they are real dangerous. But once you're anointed, the devil is hunting. He will be fighting, fighting, fighting your blessing. But don't get frightened, frightened. He will never win. New levels does bring new devils. Because just of those fake people, hey, you know them. Come on. I am not afraid of the words of my enemy As much as I concerned about the silence of my friends I am not afraid of the words of my enemy As much as I concerned about the silence of my friends Cause your enemy got no chance He go maintain his distance Yes, your enemy with one glance You see his disappearance But your friends, they go sit with you, uh-huh they go drink with you, uh huh. They go smile with you, and when they done, 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 they talk, are you afraid? But the words of my enemy, as much as I'm concerned about the silence of my friends. Hey, <laughs> you agree with me, Dominicans? Oh, ho, ho, ho. Mm. Thank you, and be we of the silent friends, my dear. Mm. Sure. Joy Stout there going off stage, one of our um, well well known songst songsters in Dominica. She has won a few competitions. Um, jo Joy is a musician and um, of course doing it differently the way that Bob Marley did it. Um, your best enemy could be your your worst enemy could be your best friend and your best friend your worst enemy. Of course employing um, rhetoric there and of course the, the, the use of the the figurative language there, well put, just saying it in a different style. And of course, that song is, is, could be a big song um, if it's properly developed further and um, could, create, um, um, could create problems for maybe a king or a queen on the night with two big songs. Well, um, you may know Joy has a beautiful voice, sweet, melodious voice, very comfortable on stage, as you could see. You, you'd never know that it's her first time in a Calypso competition. And um, I, 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 what I was thinking last year, Tasha P sang something for enemies. You remember that? 
that yes, you want yes, to come yes, 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 to yes, 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 yes. We have heard a, a number of songs, you know, down that trend. So I was expecting a little more creativity. Well, it's know. different though. The way that it's 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 done in a lot in she's em, the the writer is employing rhetoric there. Yeah, I see and, that. And um, using the um, metaphoric la um, style, so it is it is it, and sets you thinking and and forces you to listen. And, and makes you want to bounce and weave along because it has a beautiful melody. She has a very good voice. And the way it is done, it is done differently. And um, it's all part of the Calypso process and it's all style. And it's some, and I mean, it's, I mean, melody can be dangerous. And if that song is developed properly with that type of melody, it can create problems. Well, yes, I, I agree that's a very good melody, but I still feel they can reassess the be writing a little bit the lyrics a little bit you know to strengthen it well uh, you know, i that, mean, that, that, that's uh, what I, I mean that, you that you, I'm, you I'm could write 20 times and tear the page and write again yeah and that's that's the thing about writing that's it that's <laughs> it so that but 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 other than that i mean very good um performance by joy and is, is it work i guess to the next wrong for joy uh, yes i would want to believe so but yeah. We are not judges here, so I mean. Well, um, our job is to do that, eh, Doc. And I always <laughs> say, uh, um, the judge's job is to judge. Our job is to analyze. Well, which is uh, what we're uh, doing. Yeah. And I want to agree with you that it's it's a, a walk in the park for her tonight. Of yeah. course. Uh, give me. Scarra say is reset. And our party upset. Whoa, yeah. Whoa, yeah. They crying fall. And they tired ball. Whoa, yeah. Whoa, yeah. They going wrong tongue. Calling for electoral reform. They say it's moral. No taking part at all. If you just agree, they wasn't ready. They have no clothes. They naked body exposed. Scare watch yo. Two to knee, no sliders, no boxers. Two to knee, no panty, no brazier. Two to knee, no pretty sight to see. Two to knee, scare a call to a lee. Them bazoody and sleepy, the naked truth. Caught them sleeping in the nude. I give me. Scarret Calling new mandate Create the shockwave Whoa yeah Whoa yeah Void of vision The opposition Whoa yeah Whoa yeah They talk about boycotting When caught them napping They say it's illegal Wanting to get on bad they should just quit, cause they on feet. Try cover their nakedness, naked contempt for peace. Two to knee, no sliders, no boxers. Two to knee, no pretty sight to see. Two to knee, ah la la la. Two to knee, scare a call to a lead. Them bazoody and sleepy, the naked truth. Got them sleeping in the nude. The naked truth. Got them sleeping in the nude. Linton. Thank you, thank you. Very interesting way there of putting the expression um, caught with your pants down or where one is caught in an embarrassing position. Um, it's interesting that the writer found a different way to say it and he's saying it in the nude. Of course, interesting social political commentary there, which is all part of the Calypso art form and is all part of the carnival and all part of competition, Edgar. Yes, I love the way he tried to play with in the nude, you know, um, very interesting, as you said. You know, um, I like Asmis because I think he will write most of his songs. And I think he's slowly developing as a writer. You know, his work is getting better and better. 
Now he has a limitation as you can see in terms of the rendition, but um, you can see him better work he, he is happening. And as we see, the politics is singing both sides tonight. We heard uh, earlier one from Genius, and look, we have another one. So, and then, so I, I, I like how the season is going so far. And, and that's very important, you know, Edgar, that um, when we listen to Calypsonians, you know, on all sides of the fence, uh, we can get lyrical content that really, um, I don't want to use the word blows, because we have not heard any hard hitting blows, but we have heard some great improved um, lyrical content this, this time around, things that we have been asking for. Um, one of them, as we heard earlier on, from that of us, from um, that of um, Trilogy. Um, Trilogy, and also to that of um, uh, earlier on Shanice, and uh, even Black Diamond, Black Diamond, and um, and uh, this young guy, this young um, Mighty D, you know, Mighty D, yes. yeah, you know, these these are four four persons that are really um, coming forward to 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 me in terms of going to the next round. Well, we have plenty of students to go before we decide the next round. And, 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 and the next one should yes. be um, Lulu, Lulu is supposed to be next. Yes. Um, I don't have the name, or the title of the song, but um, I'm sure the. The MCs will announce it in a while. Lulu. And I remember Lulu from with my pal rep last year. Greedy the greedy, this one. Sang last year, but my pal rep this year is singing Greedy the greedy. Last year in the virtu virtual competition. And I would have one of my favorite songs, my pal rep. Yes. Let's go on stage for the Lulu. Yeah, I. Some people want to go to heaven, but they're doing work to go to hell. The way they deal with the poor and needy people, greedy, they greedy. They have house but still want an apartment, while some people still living in tents. On the government and people money, yeah, I, greedy, they greedy. They have more money than they can ever spend. None for we, all for them. They have food to waste, why some starving? More they put on weight is more they eating against their own self. They competing. They so want to win. They still cheating. They have their wife at home, but they want yours to everything for them. Away and none for you. Yeah, I. Ooh. Some of them so avaricious. They no longer see nothing wrong in politicians enslaving us. Yeah, long as they have some. Some of them faking agriculture, using the NEP workers to undersell the local farmers. Yeah, for us, yo, for us. They have more money than they can ever spend. None for we, all for them. They have food to it, like we're well starving. More they put on weight, is more they eating against their own self. They competing, they so want to win, they still cheating. 
They have their wife at home, but they want your school. Everything for them and none for you. Yeah. Ooh. Thank you. Lolo. Lolo. Greedy. Well, yeah, man. Greed, you know what? Lolo in 2022, go to 2023. I must say, an improved Lolo um, from what we have seen before. Uh, voice control is better. Um, even the contents of his lyrics, it's hard pongy. Well, I suspect what um, Duncan was saying about Pat Aaron, I suspect this one was written by Pat Aaron. So as you can see, the jacket fits Lulu. And um, you know, you can see the typical Pat Aaron melody lines in it. You know, and the, the, the hard-hitting, greedy, the greedy, woe as the woe as. So it's a, a, a nicely written song. And uh, it's my hope that Lulu can cross with this one this year. Well, we wish him all the best. Um, clearly, he's um, in a better zone than he has been um, in previous years. He's certainly an improved um, artist on stage, and he certainly has better lyrics as a Calypsonian and a competitor here tonight. Um, it's a tight competition as to who um, will be the final 12. Um, your guess is as good as mine, but um, we, we certainly have seen um, those who are, I, I believe, who are a little stronger or have been stronger um, so far. Yes, and I agree. I, I, I can easily see about five people who are up there in the top five so far. Well, I, I, I too, uh, I've clearly can see, I've seen so far Shanis. Um, I have seen um, Mighty T. I've also seen um, Abia. Um, also that of Son of the Saints and uh, Trilogy. Um, Black Diamond and uh, Joyce. Uh, joy, 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 joy. Sorry. Out, yeah. yeah, I, I, I feel um, these these people thus far can 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 make it to the next level. But you realize we are just at number twenty-seven. Yes, and we're going up to fifty-five. Uh -huh. yeah. And you have some hard hitters uh, coming. You have um, people like Daddy Chess coming. Mighty, you have Sai. Mighty yeah. Omi. Well, I don't think Sai is singing tonight. Sai is not singing tonight. You have Explosion. If a soul, that's a, I heard it before, it's a big one. And the next Calypso will be Cal, Cal for P. I'm not so sure what he's singing. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Bidang, 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 bidang. Hey. Bing, bang, bang, bidang. Diggy, diggy, dig, diggy, diggy. Live. All of us have it. Love Most of us waste it. Yes. We wake up in the morning in the wrong shop. Don't even say a prayer swearing all about. We must try to be more creative. We must try to be more productive. So when we can't perform no more. People won't say that we mal to buy. Do like me, put things in place. No more time to waste, 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 waste. So it's beep, beep, pom, pom, beep, beep, a fixing on. Pom, pom, beep, beep, pom, pom, my retirement plan. Beep, beep, pom, pom, beep, beep, a fixing on. If you have a honing problem, call me, I will come. Because Reggie had a problem and I fix it. Thomas had a problem and I solve it. Sometimes it's just a little screw. And I can turn that to a new. So call on me, you can hunt me. Just call on me and I'll be there. Just call on me. You can on me and I'll be there. Whoa! Bidang barang barang barang, bidang barang barang barang. Digi digi, dig digi dig. Bing barang, bang 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 barang.
circumstances beyond our control. Well, I'm not sure what happened there, though. Well, um, I suspect, see, that like we saw many years ago at the Portersville Savannah, the mic went off. Technical difficulty. Technical difficulty. Technical difficulty. Okay. Yes. Because okay. he was singing, you could see he was singing his song. Yes. Right through, he never stopped singing. So, well, what are, what do you think of over here so far, Duncan? A very interesting song, though, from Kalfa P. Um, um, I was listening at, um, very carefully to the development of that one because I was trying to find out where exactly he was going and it was very interesting the way he was spinning um, with that one. A very interesting um, employment of the metaphors there and the double entendre. Well, for me, quite a lot of googly. Let's, let's, let's go back on, let's go back on, let's go back on, on stage. For P again. Life, all of us have it. Loving, most of us waste it. Yes, we wake up in the morning in the rum shop. Don't even say a prayer, swearing all about. We must try to be more creative. We must try to be more productive. So when we can't perform no more, people won't say that we mal to buy. Do like me, put things in play. No more time to waste, 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 waste. So it's beep, beep, pom, pom, beep. Beep, I'm fixing on. Pom, pom, beep, beep, pom. Pom, my retirement plan. Beep, beep, pom, pom, beep. I fix it on. If you have a honing problem, call me, I will come. Because Reggie had a problem and I fix it. Thomas had a problem and I solve it. Sometimes it's just an old screw. And I can turn that to a new. Just call on me, you can hunt me. Just call on me and I'll be there. Just call on me, you can hunt me, and I'll be there. Whoa! Diggy diggy, diggy ding, diggy diggy, diggy ding. Hey! Bang bang, bing bang. Oh gosh! Life, a gift from the Father. Lavi, you don't know how long you will be here. Yeah. You wake up wondering what's your purpose. Live life like you don't care, no motivation. What's your value, your destiny? Nothing in life comes easy. So if you think I'm a dog crazy, if it's on a fixing to make a penny, so time to tie up your words. The horn master is on your case, 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 case. So it's beep, beep, boom, boom, beep, beep, a fixing horn. Boom, boom, beep, beep, boom, boom, my retirement plan. So it's beep, beep, boom, boom, beep. People fixing on. If you have a honing problem, call me, I will come. Because Reggie had a problem and I fix it. Thomas had a problem and I solve it. Sometimes it's just an old screw. And I can turn that to a new. Just call on me. You can hunt me. Just call on me and I'll be there. Just call on me. You can hold me and I'll be there. Whoa! Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. I love you. Bling and bang bang. Well, I love this one, Duncan and Edgar. Um, it speaks about relationships um, and many other things, saying to you basically 
if you are a bad driver, I can become a very good driver. But he's using the word horn um, in a double meaning um, when you hear it. And, and I just love the way that he's been able to use the word horn. My only issue, though, Cecil, having heard the two verses now, I um, it is really it's in, I think it's really intended to be a humorous song, and um, and it it really needs much more wit. It 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 should be a witty piece, and I'm, I I would want to use the example of something like Man Family by Zanduli. Millicent, you taking me from Mickey Mouse, too much man in me house, etc. etc. I I want to know. I want you to write all your family name on a piece of paper for me. And there's a lot of wit in that type of song. And I think that is the type of song that he was trying to create there. Um, and, and these type of songs, to really have the, 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 the crowd ro go roaring and the people with you, you really need to employ more wit so people can laugh, people can chuckle, people can, and I mean, to employ yourself, you know, wet their pants. Yes, Duncan, and I agree with you. I mean, I, I was feeling the same way. I am. It started well, and then as you said, I mean, to keep a song like that, you need you really need to have more humor, and it have to have again. I mean, use the different metaphors, use the use the, use the, use the, use the different language to make it even more powerful, you know. And but I still like the fact that he tried to be creative. I want to credit him you have for to. using the horn, the transport horn, to speak about the transport horn, you know. And I, I think it was a good attempt by um, the Calypsonian. What about, us, what about us who look at it on a, on a serious side of getting to do things the right way because he speaks about life. He but tells us that if we don't take life serious, you know, you will be, you'll be horn and that horn could be your mal to avoid. Well, they tell you life is too important to be taken seriously. So yes, you're talking about life, but at the same time, you want people to enjoy their life. And this is the type of song that, yes, you're talking about um, issues and incidents in life, and you really want people to enjoy themselves. As I say, you, you want at the end of the, the, when that song is finished, you have people literally wetting themselves, well, you know, from, from, from laughter. There, there, might be two more, there might be two more verses, so let's wait for it. Well, that's what, I, well, that's yeah, what we're hoping. Yeah. Well, the next kind of song is going to be Mighty Omi, and he's going to be singing Who's to Blame. We know Mighty Omi has been in, in the arena for a number of years, you know, um, bringing his, his witty songs are always across to us every year. Run it, stars. Dida, dida, do. Dida, dida, die. I tell you. Listen up. A young girl brutally killed, beaten, ripped, and left to bleed. Society focus on she lifestyle and blame she for she demise. In the meantime, the animal who did this from spree, I'm left to wonder for who we really feel sorry. So I ask these questions. Where did we go wrong? What have we done? Have right become strong? Why we reluctant to blame people for their actions? And we giving wrong people protection. We need to realize we helping in society demise. It's a big shame. Blame who's to blame? We need to open our eyes, we are up in a spiral in demise. It's a big shame, blame who's to blame. It's not a game, call the villains by name. It's a shame, Adam shame, when the victims are being blamed. Blame who's to blame. Di da di da do. Did I, did I die? I tell you, Kaiso, listen up. Young boy sexually abused, molested, used, and left confused. Society hide the predators and dismiss stories as rumors. In the meantime, the beast that did it roams free. While stigmatized boys. Running mad on these streets. 
So I ask these questions. Where did we go wrong? What have we done? Have we lost our conscience? Why there's so much silence for such actions? Why are we failing to give our boys protection? We need to realize we're helping in society demise. It's a big shame. Blame who's to blame? We need to open our eyes. We are up in a spiral in demise. It's a big shame. Blame who's to blame? It's not a game. Call the villains by name. It's a shame. Adam shame. When the victims are being blamed, blame who's to blame? Di da di da do, di da di da die. I tell you, thank you, ladies and gentlemen. I love you. Mighty. Mighty Omi there going off stage, one of the more popular artists, Calypsonians over the years. He's, he has um, 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 impairment from his vision, so he often has to be assisted on stage and off stage. Different style though from the Mighty Omi, a very interesting way that he puts this one. Um, oftentimes we put the blame on the victim if there is some is incident of violence or crime, and he's saying, no, no, no. The responsibility has to be placed squarely. And he's doing it in a different way. And that's what I like about the writing in this one. Well, Duncan, I mean, when I heard that song, I, I know today, I don't know if you know that we are, you know, we are the murder today. You know, I heard that. I, I, heard mean, that. I was yeah, looking at social media and I, I see people trying to blame the victim instead of blaming the villain. And Mighty Umi addressed it well. And you know, we have issues where young women are, uh, are sexually abused and young men and so. Children. And yeah, and, we, and I, I see people trying to blame the children instead of blaming the, the villain. So I think, and a nice melody, I don't kind of really sweet Beautiful melody, melody. And you could see Mighty Umi is very comfortable on one like that. I can see this one growing as the season goes on, you know, really lovely melody. And very and what current. I, and what I like about um, tonight's Calypso's is that um, especially this one of Omi and, and the one earlier on of Shanice, you know, talking about issues that really affecting us and many a times we are scared to talk about the issue that is relevant and tonight we see Omi singing who's to blame and it's important that we, 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 we say who's to blame and tonight uh, um, we have just seen Omi doing a very good job in, in really sending a message across and really helping us as a society to look at issues and deal with the issues as they are. Although I would call it blame who is to blame though, Duncan. I don't know what you think. Blame who is to blame? Yes, instead of who is to blame. Um, well, the, it, I think it's basically, well, he's using um, poetic license here okay. to put that one together. I think that's what is happening. Okay. And that is what I like about this year's um, competition. A number of the songs that I've heard so far, the way they are written, um, I like the, the, the fact that persons are thinking and finding different ways to say different things. We know what the meanings are, um, but however, it's a different approach. And you have to give credit to the writers um, um, this year. And I also have to give credit to people like you, Duncan, for keep encouraging writers to get creative, you know, and we, we can actually see it coming through. But it not only that, Edgar, what we have been able to do at, from DBS Broadcast is to say what a spade is. And I think the Caliph students are actually listening attentively and really taking our advice. Yeah, let's go on stage. And I must say this conversation is very tight. Uh, let's go on stage for Energizer, liar, liar. Yeah, liar, your pants on fire. To Tau Kadi, say your mati. Liar, liar, your pants on fire. To Tau Kadi, say your mati. Woo! Energizer. Hey! Over 20 years, we struggling. We not making progress on this island. Gun violence. Has taken over, no law, no constitution on this island. Dominica out of order, no regulation, no price control. Dominica out of control. 
For Dominica to grow, grow The leader must go right now For Dominica to grow, grow The leader must go right now Woo! When last you had a life bill And you could pay, tell me Can you buy groceries? Like you lying in your campaign, you promised geothermal to reduce the cost of life. Everything will be nice, 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 nice. Money spent on geothermal could have provided solar panels, could have equipped the hospital. Yes, yes, yes. For Dominica to grow, grow, the leader must go right now. For Dominica to grow, grow, the leader must go. Right now, you agree with me? Think so, hard, Dominica. Boy, I just sweat. Good night. Energizer! They say our pants is on fire. Well, they say our pants is. This is Kaiso. Let me see your hands up in the air for Kaiso. Woo! And freedom of speech and expression. Well, <laughs> we hear this one from the Energizer, liar, liar, your pants on fire. He really energized the crowd here tonight. I like the last part he made. He said that you all are what? Did you get it? Edgar? Huh? I don't remember. I don't remember. <laughs> he said you all are twits. Yeah. <laughs> because he has a question. I like the Energizer. He does his thing. You know, and you need people like Energizer and Calypso. You know, they bring... He came, he, his message, he, 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 he brought out his message, you know, and um, I like that about people like Energizer, that every year they come and they bring out the message. You know, a very good entertainer, though. He's very comfortable on stage, you know, and he delivers his stuff. Direct and to the point, and of course, we should let our listeners know that he's a former road match king in Dominica. I'm trying to remember the one that he, run, he won the road match with. Um, Cecil, I know you are the historian on the panel there. I'll definitely get that for you. <laughs> yes, Duncan, but I, but I, I, I don't know. I really like he, the way he brings up. I just say direct message. He's a hard hitter. He came to bring his message, and he did bring the message across. Yes, I um, indeed. And he was direct, as you said, um, yeah. Edgar, and to the point. And, of course, he was throwing the punches. And, of course, I mean, whoever was in line certainly would not have gotten out of that ring unscathed. So he was really blazing. Yes, and I, I agree, and uh, that's why, and that's good for Calypso. You know, I mean, even if he doesn't make it to the next round, but he really made his contribution, and he must be congratulated for good work. And 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 we can see the growth, as I was saying earlier on, um, Edgar, in reference to what we actually see um, in terms of our commentary about Calypsos and Calypsonians, and um, I'm sure we are going to be seeing much more. Um, improvement as we go along because we will be telling the, the, the Calypsonians and their management because I'm sure that they're listening to us and because whatever we do we do it very very honest and, and I'm sure that the, this honesty will, will go along with many many Calypsonians. Well they, they, they are definitely listening you know, because they bring their song some of them to me to critique you know I think it's intermission Cecil I think so, it's so it's we should it's it's take it's a word from our sponsors. Well we can continue uh -huh. and um we, we must say that I, um, that there are quite a number of persons, um, people that are actually listening to this broadcast live from the diaspora. Just want to say uh, good evening to um, Hermia Mason, um, a constant listener of DBS Radio. I saw her son um, in Dominica. Um, she has two sons, as we know. Um, one of a prolific batsman, um, cricketer, now a member of the association, um, the Cricket Association. So I just want to say good evening to... Um, Hermia Mason in the United States. I also want to say good evening to Miss Collis Joseph. She is also in the United States in Virginia and she is listening. Your friend Charles to Samuel said to say hello to you. You are his mentor, Cecil Joseph. Well, that's a good buddy of mine for many, many years. I know that I think he's in North Carolina as we speak um, in the US of A. Uh, I also want to say good evening to my mom um, who loves Calypso from many, 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 many moons. Um, I remember as a boy growing up, um, when I could not have gone to the, to the show because I, I, I went to the first show in 1977, but she always listened to Calypso and I know tonight, even at the age of uh, 84, that she'd still be listening 
I also want to say good evening to Renick Thomas, who constantly listens to DBS Radio. Smokey, you know, you remember Smokey the Calypsonia? Yes, I remember. Yeah. I think he sang together with, with Duncan. Yes, Smokey, as in Florida. Good evening, Smokey. He's always um, on, um, listening. Um, from time to time, I know in, in some of the bigger shows, he would send me a note uh, or two of what he thought um, of the, uh, a particular performer. And um, Smokey, of course, he still um, um, keeps his, his, his head on, on, on the, the ground as it relates to Calypso in Dominica. And I also want to say good evening to people like Nigel Francis. I'm sure he's definitely listening. And people like Merlin Stentile, former Calypso king of Dominica, definitely listening. And to my cousin in New York City, Tafara Talbot, I know she's listening. I know she, she likes to take her kicks too. She likes the funny Calypso dance. I know Energizer rocked her a while ago. And also, I want to say good evening to Snapper, um, Wilmot um, of Nura, uh, from Buffy State, but is in New York. And also Glenda Ashby, or Ashby, sorry, um, from Newton. She's always tuned to DBS Radio, and that's one of her favorite time, um, Calypso period. So we have a whole host, a lot of, we have a lot of listeners, um, Cecil. And they are wondering, though, why we're not live on Facebook. Well, well, you know there are a number of things that has to be that a number of things that have to be done to ensure that this is done, you know, the way that it's supposed to be done properly. And I'm one of the person who believes in doing things properly. So for sure, from the quarterfinals, um, we will be doing live our shows. Um, I'm sure that um, we, we when when we do that, we don't want people to be complaining. One of the things that's important is not doing things at a rush, but doing it properly. Because in this present dispensation, we have to do things well. And one of the things that we're talking about virtual, and um, while while we it's it's no longer the virtual one wrong show, but yet still, um, you're going to see a lot more virtual um, events. And so um, we will want we will want to do it the right way that we know best. Yes, and I I mean I I want to compliment DBS. I went come for quality. I mean DBS is the best in terms of the um, bringing the virtual production together. I have seen it myself. I remember last um, finals, the virtual finals, I was home because I was done with COVID and I was looking at it. I, I, I bought the stream from DBS and I mean really, really high quality. You know, and again, in terms of the comments I mean, when you have my mentor, Duncan Stu, on any panel, I mean, um, this to me- Workers. But, yeah, workers, but I was speaking about Duncan Do. Mm -hmm. To me, he's the best. When come to commentary in Dominican. I mean, I, I, I am always happy when I can at least sit side by side with him, you know. And I, I mean, I want to congratulate him for the kind of work he has been doing over the years and mentoring others like me, you know, pulling us up when you know when we let down, you know, but really helping us to grow and to do the commentary much better. And uh, what was also important to um, Edgar is uh, when you have people like Duncan and Walkers, Walkers himself, who is involved. In music, in the music industry, um, I think a writer, um, also a, a, a musician, um, playing guitar and, and understands the value of, of proper melody, um, really helps in the broadcast in making people understand the notes, what, what, what goes wrong. And so um, having Duncan, who can actually describe, you know, every, every line. Yes, by profession, he's, a, he's an attorney. Um, that helps him to even do it even better. Um, it says quite a lot of DBS broadcast and yourself and myself uh, we are able to to evaluate what we have seen and, and be able to to tell the general public exactly where the calypsos will go of course gentlemen thanks for that um compliment but i i cannot just take it alone um there are many persons who have gone before me and who went before me who oftentimes i would have listened to on the radio and learned from them so I didn't just come up there and just do it on myself, on my own. Um, there were persons like the great Barnett Defoe, um, who oftentimes I listen to um, in times like these in terms of um, Calypso broadcast. The Alvin Knights, um, Steinberg Henrys, the Tim Duras, and um, of course Joseph. the Dennis Josephs. Or you know? the Luis. Or the Luis. Oh, well, or you, oh, well, exactly. So, I mean, it's a case where you, you read, you listen, you observe, you learn and of course um you express your, yourselves and you follow all the calypsonians around the world yeah well yeah you follow calypsonians all along the world and of course i had the opportunity of of you know um of being trained by um, um some of the senior broadcasters in the region where they tell you what it is you ought to do things you you can say things you ought not to say um things you 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 you, you need to know your subject first of all 
and express yourself accordingly. And one of the, the most important things that you have to do is to try to bring your listener to the scene. And um, um, that, that's part of, the, of, the, of the, the job, part of the process, part of the profession. And um, I must say um, thank you to all those who I learned from. But, but you know, the Sherman Greens, you know, that type of thing. But Duncan, we can yeah. go back a bit, you know. Yeah. And the Tim Dura, uh, don't forget. He said no, Tim Dura. I, I, I call him oh, oh, yeah. yeah. well, Let's go back a little bit, Duncan. Yes. Michael discussion. Peter Boggs. I, I was about to say, um, um, Duncan, yes. let's go back a little bit. Sir. In your time as a young boy, you know, at the Summers Academy, singing together with Trinado, Trinado and that of Zico and, and, and some other Calypsonians in those good old days. Those you know, days, it was really fun, you know. I mean, we were at school. And um, we had a, a few musicians who um, who made it big. Hurricane, um, you know, one of the things that I did, whenever I say I wrote a song, um, Hurricane would 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 um, structure the chords. I might have had an idea in terms of a, a, of a tune, a melody, and I would work with Hurricane and Wackers, um, because both of them were at the St. Mary's Academy at the time, and um, um, a lot they contributed a lot to some of the the successes that I had as a junior monarch, as a junior Calypsonian at the St. Mary's Academy. One of the persons who gave me a lot of support also um, was um, Kovlik Elwin of Blessed Memory. And you know, he, he supported us a lot, especially when- He was we the were, coordinator then? Yeah, he was the coordinator. And of course, I didn't only take part in Calypso, but I also took part in other activities in school because we had persons like Monsignor John Lewis, and um, we used to have, um, um, we had a few productions, theatrical productions with most senior journalists. So you learn from that, you know, and uh, a lot of things that you learn. Of course, the persons like um, the Alwyn Bullies, you know, you learned a lot of, I learned a lot of from them um, in the days when we had the People's Action Theatre. Um, there are a lot of things that you do in drama, um, you can move it across to broadcasting. So I have to say good evening to people like Alwyn and Anita, and there were so many other persons. I mean, the entire, maybe entourage, the entire membership of the People's Action Theatre, Norin Joseph, um, who um, just might be somewhere listening. And um, it is from that, those experiences, that I bring to bear some of the, the, the successes that, um, that I am told that, um, uh, or some of the, if you want to say, um, the, the, the accolades that are being bestowed. Um, but, but Duncan, what, mm. what really bestows me the most mm. is that you have been able to, at, 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 as a boy, young boy going to St. Mary's Academy, been able to get the, the crown at St. Mary's Academy, junior monarch, but you never saw the need to go to the big, to the big tent. Well, what had happened was that, I mean, um, after uh, St. Mary's Academy, I had, so, had migrated and I was out for about three, three years. And um, when I come back, I was I was thrusted into judging. So from since I mean I've been I've judged Calypso from since the early 80s. Um, I worked as a judge and in and also became involved um, in broadcasting. So I was I got myself involved in that area and I just never got back into the action of being on stage but more involved in maybe somebody, as Ed, Edgar said, come to you with a song, come to you with an idea, and I say, yeah, that's a very good idea. And, um, you know, you can develop that. But, but it you must know, be some, somebody comes to you with a song, and you say, man, I would move that there, move this here, and um, um, give some advice. But it must, be, it must be said, Duncan, that um, in your family runs quite a number of Calypsonians. Well, your, 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 your big brother, Embert Stowe, my eldest brother, uh, that's yeah, correct. Um, your other brother, uh, Akers Stowe. Akers was, yes, that's, that's true. Well, um, and then, uh -huh. well, we, I came from a family with a lot of musicians. And still today, I mean, my, one of my brothers, all my brothers are involved in music. Really still. Akers, Burnham, and, and my brother Fifi. Fifi is, a, is an engineer and he does low voltage installation. He one time used to have his own band. He still has his, his song system that he goes all over um, the US to install, to do installation in terms of song systems, to do um, um, engineering for groups, for various groups. He's done it, um, so he's still involved. So from that perspective, I've sort of grown up in that. I had an aunt who taught um, piano um, lessons. So one of my regrets, I always say, is not having followed through with my music. So I just did in terms of, of, of music, 
and um, the formal aspects of, of learning music, I didn't go further than grade two. And that's a regret. And of course, in terms of the pl playing of the piano and playing of the guitar, you did a little bit of that when you were a youth. Uh, youth and then you know you left it and but my brothers and them all of them kept it and that's one of my regrets so you know as the songwriter says regrets i've had a few that's one of my regrets in life not having continued and followed through my music okay thank you duncan i'm um, cecil can we just review the first song for our listeners yeah well the first one we saw um lioness uh, singing i have to roar and uh, she did roar yeah she and, uh, um uh, well, she made a few um, technical two, errors that, that, that um, so I don't think that she stand a very good chance based on the level of competition tonight. Luscious, um, she came with sauce up. Um, I said it was sporty. Play of words of the word sauce yeah, up. I won't say sporty. It was more pun though. Yeah. I, w I would more put put it in the in yeah. zone of a pun. I, I won't say sporty. Uh -huh. it, it was very very well done though. Yeah. Um, whoever wrote that song, sauce up. Yeah. And all of us, we have an appreciation for that fruit. Those of us who grow up and those of us who eat sour soup and do, those of us who eat sour soup as kids, you know, you can spin with that that fruit. And she, the, the writer did justice to it, yeah, I think. And I concur. And as I was telling Cecil earlier, I don't think it's a small. Well, well I saw, I, I, in, in the song, I saw quite a number of words that would lead me to think that it was. And that's why I, I, I maintain the point. Yeah, that, but uh, I show but, you. But, uh, I, according I, to Duncan, it's a, it's a, it's a play of words. Um, but um, we, we would, I'm sure, years to come, but we, 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 we may just uh, concede and say that, that, that it was. And uh, maybe no. light smart. <laughs> uh, no, well, I, I like um, people to be creative. And uh, once you're creative, I mean, you, and I, I didn't see her use any word that was in parties and that, that, that came out smarty. Sweet, fat. Yeah, but that is a sauce up. So something to be sweet, big. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that juicy? Juicy. This is what that's a sauce of. <laughs> so, I mean. Anyway, we have we saw Shanice yeah. sang hashtag. Uh, that is one that we, we felt that was important. Concerned. Yes. Yeah. Um. And Duncan, this one, I I don't know if you were there already. I, I was not in the in in the park, but I listened to it on the radio and I found it to be a, to be a very well written song, very current, very topical, a very interesting lament the way it was put. And of course, I mean, I always pull the 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 the, the uh, meaning that um or um that that Duke of Blessed Memory Kelvin Pope gave to Calypso when he asked, "What is Calypso? It is an editorial in song of the life that we undergo." And clearly, that is an indication of what it is we're living. One of the issues that we're living with right now, where people are heartless to an extent. I mean, it it is a form of of just. I mean, gross disrespect for humanity when you tell me that someone is under the gun, someone is being beaten, someone is being killed, someone is struggling for their life, and you 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 record that on a on a tel on a phone or wherever, and you you hashtag all over the world. I mean, come on. And many times the family members are not aware, and to get the message on 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 social media, it's really hurtful. Okay. It is. At number five, we had DBS singing Playing Mass. And at number six, we also had um, Genius. Yes. And uh, Niza, Nizaya, um, singing Dog Eat Dog. Yeah, and that what one that resonated well with you, um, Cecil. But I, as I tell you, I am. She reminds me a little of Della. You said Tarina, but she, I, she reminds me a little of Della. It's a message that, uh, that resonates well with people. Because, and, I, and tonight I heard a number of the songs have that line dog eat dog uh, if you will listen closely um a number of the calypsonians seem to have had this line so it's something that resonated very well with people and i think she did justice to the song yes and, she did and then we had tri um, tr um trinity, trinity singing bomb yes singing bomb but trinity was not his usual self tonight gentlemen I agree with what it is, but there is some potential in this song, Duncan. There is. Yes, and um, I think that could slide him through because the what's been judged tonight is just melody and lyrics. 35 points of melody and 35 points of lyrics. But we should remind our listeners, though, that this is the Dominica Calypso Elimination 2023. So usually at the eliminations, you would not have situations where the, the artists are well rehearsed. They might have just maybe gotten one rehearsal 
um, on the on the, the the background music that they have and they're here tonight. Um, but the music songs good um, overall, generally. Um, but it is the eliminations and um, artists are not as prepared as they would be at the um, quarterfinals or higher up. And I mentioned that earlier that some of them maybe just got the song and they're just getting, uh, they're just learning the, the, the lyrics, you know. So they, they, they really kind of deliver it in a way where they're very comfortable. And we heard the other Calypsonian, Mighty D, singing Talking Dog. That one resonates quite a lot among the huge crowd that is here tonight. Uh, you saw that when he first mentioned about dog, it, d talking dog, um, he said, how, how, how. That, that was very, very creative. creative That's a culture. very original piece. Um, he reminded me of, um, um, from out of Trinidad, um, he's not uh, a big artist right now. When he, he, did, he, he did that song, Who Let the Dogs Off? Hoof, hoof. Yeah, I remember that, yeah. That was, um, I'm trying to remember his name now. Oh my God. Uh, uh, yeah, but anyway, um, that, that is, it is in that, to me, it is in that zone of creativity um, where someone really thinks and, and comes with a, a, an, in, an original and interesting line of doing something and putting it together with a, a, a song that has some meaning. Yeah, and Duncan, the Iowa, Iowa George, Iowa George. Yes, and he had a discussion going on between the two dogs. Yes. yes, you yes, know yes, one yes, dog yes, say, yes. I, you know I, I like that um that, that I, I like that creativity. I suspect it's JD. I'm not sure. It's JD. JD I, did I, I don't this want one. to give people. Um, no, JD did for. this one. Well, if JD did this one, if this is a beautiful one, and this young man has improved tremendously. To me, he's the most improved Calypsonian from from, la, from for, for, for over the past three four years. Then we heard indeed. Then we heard Mighty Jack. Then the food eye. What do you make of food eye? Um, food eye is a typical food eye. It's usually a long song. Um, I mean, he did it as a, uh, what, what would I say about I mean, he's a senior competitor, so they know how to bring their stuff around. But I find it's usually the same food I a very long song, and completely and there about certain issues, political issues, I suspect. I mean, yes, yes, but I, 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 I he, he, he had me lost for a while, because I was trying to, to follow him, um, in the well throughout, um, usually you have a, a, a your first and your development and your refrain, but it was almost like it was a, a very long poem, and um, you were wondering where you were gonna get a, um, the refrain, and not that you must have a refrain, but you were looking for something almost to link and connect in terms of the story. And um, um, I think, um, I not, I'm not sure whether he succeeded in doing what he was maybe trying and, to and do. And as you said that, um, um, Duncan, I'm, I'm not realizing, even while I was listening, I was trying to get the bridge um, from one verse to the other. Correct. And I did not even get that. And, and it was telling me that he was, well, I, I felt that his song was very flat. As long as um, Edgar said that quite a lot of complaints um, that he made in his song. But I maybe also we find the melody itself, Duncan. It wasn't meandering it, you know. It wasn't making yeah. the song interesting. Um, it, it was very you think. straight melody, you know. A beer came in surprise. at number 12. Surprise, nice surprise, surprise. I think there's too many surprises in yeah, this song. Too, too much too surprise. Many. I think she, she needs to, I mean, she needs to really resonate the points of surprises. She needs to bring the surprise, not yeah, tell us the not surprise. tell us the surprise, you know. She needs to develop the surprise. Yeah. And, and I think um, that was for me lacking in 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 Abia's song. Great voice, um, great concept, good good um, lyrical contents. But I still believe that there's some more work that can be done. It was a very it is a very simple song in terms of the lyrical content. Very complex in terms of the music. And um, I think, as you guys said here, yeah, um, maybe um, some more development could be done on the maybe the lyrical content. Um, and Maybe um, even arrangement. It could, it, uh, the the, the, the yeah, arrangement of the music, no yeah, man. But it's very good. Yeah. Beautiful music. Yeah. Yeah. Beautiful I, music. I, I, um, but maybe I, I might be comparing for, for previous years. But, you but know? you see, but it's, it's the first wrong, and I'm really. That's the thing you find with, with songs like these, um, where they are written because the person has their message that they want to put across. Right. Mm -hmm. And they want to do it in their own style. In their own way. Um, yes. You know the kind of brother thing, rather tell you, yes. listen, I can't write for judges here. Yeah? This is always write my song. Yeah. And Rhoda puts this thing down and he gives it to you. And I, I get the feeling that the writer um, with Abia um, has that same approach, you know? And um, that is how I am sending my message. Then we, so but, 
we saw Royette, then after we saw White Ferry who sang Cross the Bridge. This one to me is good, has uh, um, promise on the road, has a uh, very nice bounce. Again, I have issues with the development, sometimes I got lost, but um, in terms of the the bounce, and so really bounce, and we know White Ferry can deliver those kind of songs. Uh, I think he's a four times Kadas King. Yes. Yeah, and he usually go for the up tempo types of songs, and he do very well with them. Then we then we had Ace singing, "That is my song." And it was definitely his song. And then, his song. Then we had Son of the Sin selling cock, a big one, a creative piece. You know, and as I said early, uh, I, early I remembered um, singing Sandra singing "Crying in the Ghetto," and um, you remember who Duncan sang? La they, they were laughing in the ghetto the next year, and I'm seeing Son of the Sin doing that, and this Son of the Sin keep presenting that song very well. Son of the Sin can go very far with this song. Well, that's a very common thing in in calypso competition right across the region, where an artist would come with a sequel the following year, right. and clearly um, Son of the Sin decided he's coming with a sequel. And rather than Kuku, he giving you cock. Nice. And then we had Lord Fonda singing de uh, Democracy. What it was? Well, they, 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 they walked, whatever, walked, whatever it was. <laughs> but Lord, Lord Fonda, at least I heard his two verses and two choruses tonight. You know, very organized, very structured tonight. Then we had Hexi singing The Running and The Walks Up. Then we had Trilogy tonight. Yeah, and this one was a big one coming from the Buyo, and as I said, he's one artist I always admire. Very lyrical in his content. You know, I always have very good messages. And tonight, I, I suspect he wrote his own song. I, I actually asked him the question tonight, and he said he wrote his own song. Yeah, so that, 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 that's very good. So this guy has potential to go find the competition. This man is a big artist. Well, yeah, in, in Buyo, he's very big. So um, coming to Calypso, that, and it's very good for Calypso, when the Buyo artists cross over, and do that, you know, and show that they can sing because a lot of the things we are just cannot sing, and they can show that they can sing and they can write good calypso. Then you had Vigilante singing the Spider Web. Then that Black Diamond, my grandmother, my granny's change, my, my granny, oh my granny's change. Yes, and this one as we said, deal with reparation, reparation, and it was a real written song by I think written by Joey Lloyd. Yes, by the father. Yes. Yeah. Then we then we had Mystery singing Rampage. Then Joy singing Silence of My Friends. And I leave Duncan to speak on Joy. <laughs> well, well, Joy, I, I think we know who Joy is. Joy Stout, and Joy has won a few competitions um, in Dominica. She has a very beautiful voice. She is a musician. She plays the violin, and um, well, she, obviously she know having a, a a good voice and can and understand read and play music you are at a big advantage there because you know how to employ um, the use of your voice and of course um that one is a very interesting way that i mean done in uh, with a lot of um rhetoric and metaphoric language there um a, a sort of um remix or remake or restructuring of the lyrics of Bob Marley, your um, worst enemy could be your best friend, and your best friend, your worst enemy. That has been said many times before. It's not anything new. The idea, the concept is not anything new, but she found, the writer found a different way to do it. And that is what, to me, good calypso and good poetry is all about. And um, if the, the, with beautiful melody, of course. And if that song is developed the way I mean, in terms of a competition, it can create problems on the night. Well, we heard the next Calypsonian as Asmis in the, in the nude. Then we heard Lulu. Then we heard Carl for P. Then we heard Mighty Omi singing Who's to Blame. And we commented on Omi already. So Yes, yeah. and then Energizer, Liar, Liar. Yeah, yeah, right. So soon from now, we'll be hearing um, Triumph, The Predator, Souf, Micah, Little J, Death Rose, a number of other characters. Death Rose, Explosion, Intruder, Danian, Lady V, Super H, Daddy Chess, King Daddy Chess, Picklock, Prince of Peace, Comforter, Mask Eruption, uh, Adi, Adi Kali, Max, oh God, Chris B. Chris B is back. Yes. Oracle is there. The Clark, Philbert Cam, and Unwanted. Well, we are halfway of the show and it's already 2351 on friday 
um, evening. Soon from now, we'll be going into mon into um, Saturday morning um, to the second half of the show. The crowd tonight is very huge for an elimination. It's very nice crowd. And I tell you, people love their Calypso. And people come to, and they are really enjoying the Calypso and responding to the Calypso there very nicely. This competition is a very difficult competition. Very tight one. To select 12 yeah. from 50, 55. It's going to be difficult for the judges. So, gentlemen, we have to fasten so, our seat belts and sit tight for the results. Well, the second the second segment of the show is uh, going to start with Triumph singing Not Ready Yet. Uh, I would like to hear this one, Not Ready Yet. Yes, sir. So, let's go to stage for the Triumph. Not this Ready Yet. You ready? Well, it is a national anthem Triumph, you grooving to slow This year election call fast So we need a calypso to match Catch them with their pants down And make sure your selection You retire, no longer police Speed up, stop directing traffic but everywhere I go, they say Triumph singing too slow, he not ready yet, he not ready yet. So I come in like burn brain and sugar reach, across the bridge I want to be ready, I want to be ready. Don't want to go to treasury, and when you go no money, they say he not ready yet. Back ATM not ready, machine don't no money, but it's me. You find to say that it's not ready yet. It's not ready yet. Hey, okay, boy. Hey, hey, hey. It ready. It ready. If you want to be there at the end, send another anthem. You singing too much dead match. Who cares about man? Eat that too. I love when you sang Bokito. But trust me, that was really too slow. Check Pat and Jacko to write a calypso. And the people will enjoy the show. So everywhere I go, they say Triumph singing too slow. He not ready yet. He not ready yet. So I come in like one brain and Mr. Reed across the bridge. I want to be ready. I want to be ready. Don't want to go to church tree. And when you go, no money. They say it not ready yet. Bank ATM no ready, machine dumb no money, but it's me. You find to say that it's not ready yet. It's not ready yet. Hey, it ready? It ready? It ready? I okay, bye. Thank you, thank you very much. Thank you, thank you very much. Triumph singing not ready yet. Yes. Well, he's just giving a commentary of himself, That's of his past songs, and uh, and what his fans are actually saying to him. He not ready yet, Duncan. Uh, well, uh, clearly he's stepping up the tempo this time. I'm not sure if he's heading for the road match um, with the not ready yet, but it's a different triumph this year, and um, he he certainly is making an effort um, as to how far this one is going to go. Um, it's, we have to wait on the judges' results um, in another hour, hour and a half thereabout, um, yeah. Cecil, and we'll know whether hour and a half, maybe more, <laughs> maybe two hours. Yeah, maybe so two we hours. might know whether um, Triumph 
is indeed ready for the competition um, 2023. And we have some big Calypsonians this year, so we know that the judges will cut up for them. And uh, we have the next Calypsonian. Uh, the next Calypsonian is um, the Predator. Stop. Mash up. Down. The police. Stop. Mash down the police. The Predator. So we're going to go on stage for the Predator. My country, my sweet, sweet country, first time in its history, we have an elections with no opposition. Papa Bautier, yeah. Ola Lukale. In my country, my sweet, sweet country, everything is upside down. You claim you so strong, but not on the ground. Reform is what the people want And all those who condone Conniving and staying silent No matter how long it takes One day you have to pay They come to march down the place Put all of us in the cemetery they come to sing down the place Put all of us under the sea They come to mash down the place Look all of us in custody While them foreign man Together with China man Will take over Dominica Maybe forever, and those who can't do, we still have a good job to be. Dominica is free again. Pam 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 Lord have mercy. The times has changed drastically. Christians, pastors, and priests behind money. They follow our leader because of money or our own money or passport money. The times has changed drastically. All institutions corrupt to the bone. To the bone they corrupt. They corrupt to the bone. Administrations corrupt to the bone. While we have poverty standard of living drugs and crime destroy nature's prime they come to mash down the place send all of us in the cemetery they come to sing down the place put all of us under the sea they mash down the place Brace all of us in our custody While them foreigners And the China man Will take over Dominica Maybe forever And those who survive 
We'll still have to stand up and fight to save Dominica for that dictator. And when we conquer, only then we'll sing a new song. Dominica is free again. They come to match down the place. But all of us in this cemetery, they come to sit down the place. Send all of us on the sea. They come to match down the place. Put all of us in our custody. While them foreign man. Together with China man. We'll take over Dominica. Maybe forever. And when we survive. Have to fight to save Dominica from that dictator. And when we conquer, redemption songs we will sing. Dominica is free again. They come to match down the place. Put all of us in this cement. They come to sing down the place. Put all of us under the sea They come to match down the place Put all of us in our custody While them foreign man Together with China Ma We'll take over Dominica Maybe forever And when to survive we we'll still have to stand up and fight to save Dominica from that dictator. And when we come, call redemption songs we will sing. Dominica is free again. They come to match them. Put all of us in this cemetery. They come to sing. Put all of us under the sea. They come to match down the place. Place all of us in our custody. While them foreign man together with China man will take over Dominica. Maybe forever. And those who survive. We still have to stand up and fight to save Dominica from that dictator. And when we come to redemption, so we will say Dominica is free again. We come to fight. All of us in our custody While them foreign man Together we shall be a mad The predictor Well, for sure, uh, this predi um, predictor got his 15 minutes of fame. And if the band did not stop, uh, he would continue his refrain and continue his refrain. Wow. <laughs> a very exciting predictor there, though, going off stage. And um, um, clearly, if he has good music and maybe good lyrics, um, he maybe could be a force to be reckoned with, though, because he has a very, very good Calypso voice. Um, when you listen to him, he has that sort of baritone voice, and um, it can be a deadly voice with good material. Two things, he may not have known the, what the rule was. One and two, if there was a, if there was a, a, a trophy 
for, for best gesticulation, he would have gotten that tonight. Well, um, <laughs> he maybe stayed on the stage for about 15 minutes, but I was enjoying him right through. He was jumping all over the stage like a kangaroo. He's a performer. Himself. Yeah, he enjoyed himself. <laughs> and he wanted, for sure, his message was direct, eh, Duncan? Live and Very direct. Very live and direct. He sung like what you on some of the radio stations that, was, that basically, you know, and he come to the, bring his message straight. And Predictor brought his message. He written about six or seven verses. And, and you realize I spoke about the gesticulation and here the Master of Ceremony actually doing quite a lot of the gesticulation that he did while he's on stage. Yeah. You know, he really entertained the crowd. Um, Duncan, you're very right. He has this baritone voice. And I think uh, if given good material, um, he would really sound powerful. Yes, um, I, I, and I agree. Um, a, 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 talent, a talented young man, but, but a little too vexed, though. He came, I know he got to be on the match along the place, but, and, and part of it, he lost his voice sometimes, you know, in that um, trying to be so, um, so strong in doing what you're saying. But I guess he brought his message, eh, Duncan? Yes, yes, yes. yes. They yes. come to match down the place, you know, so. And people like that, uh, they could be the eliminations, you know. I mean, he had a, a, a full structured song, and he did what he had to do. And I, I sure the, the crowd was entertained. They were. Yeah. And you, you could have sensed that because everyone was really cracking, you know, with laughter. And that's a clear indication that they were enjoying themselves. So, next we have um, Suf singing Shake. From the community of Vikas. Yes, Vikas. Uh, and he's a, a, a cousin who have been around for a very long, long time. time. And I think he's like the elf that have sung in many different um, competitions. But has he made it to the finals ever? Finals? <laughs> <laughs> don't, let, don't, don't, don't let um, Soul, soul, about, um, soul hear, hear you from Vikas. Not Soul, Suf. 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 No, no, no. I'm saying from another guy, another Calypsonian. Oh, oh, a junior. Solo. solo. Swallow. 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 Yes. Swallow, yes. I was just calling his name. Yes, Swallow. Yes. Yeah. Well, it looks as if. Well, it seems as if Suf is not there. Yes, yeah, so he's not here. Have a Mika. A Mika. Mika. Yeah, yes. singing Men to Beast. Men to Beast. Men to Beast. I would like to hear the lyrics of this one. A Mika came in for the first time last year and she um, gave a good account of herself. Yes. So I'm listening and Ian Jackson would fall last year. She was a standby to the from, from the eliminations. Um, if anyone would have fallen off. Here's Amika now on stage. Let's go on stage. Yes, sir. Listen to this. I hearing about this thing since I small. Guys, they getting it at all. Seems like man head harder than stone wall. Since a little I try understand It's terrible how a grown man Ah, uh, can feel passion for a child Ravage a woman like an animal in the wild Busy jail for a while Then walk out with a smile Oh God Don't molest that sister Just think of your mother Enduring the torture Don't do that my brother Don't molest your sister Just think of your mother Enduring the torture We must find a cure To deal with that sickness Bring an end to the horror Can make all men Turn to be Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sexual abuse of girls on the rise. Society closing its eyes. Culprits not affected by your cries. Some fathers guilty as well, make daughters belly swell. Uh, are women going through hell? 
girls are threatened, so they won't tell. Use money, try wash this spell while victims live in a mental cell. Don't do that, my brother. Don't molest your daughter. Just think of your mother and you're in the torture. Don't do that, my brother. Don't molest your daughter. Just think of your mother and you're in the torture. We must find a cure to deal with that sickness. Bring an end to the horror. Can watch your men turn to beast. Burn up, burn up, burn up. Yes. Hey, hey, hey! Mika, meant to be. Yes. Give it one more time for Mika. Are yeah, you man. enjoying the show? Kaiso, Kaiso, Kaiso! As if. Yeah, man. They go and sleep, man. Uh, you think so? Yes, okay. Duncan. Um, yeah, that was like a, uh, I mean, a good effort from her, but you could see that it seemed that she has a cold and she was struggling in terms of her rendition. So she could not really deliver the song, or I know she could deliver it. Very unfortunate for her there, um, because we know that she is quality on, on stage. And this time around, she had a hoarseness in her voice and was really struggling to deliver as it relates to her lyrics. But she stood the, 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 the course and um, ended um, her performance. Yeah, she wanted to bring out that message. It seemed that she cares very deeply about that message. And she really decided that she wanted to bring it to the crowd, even if she knew that her voice was not at best tonight. Uh, that's true. Um, as to where she ends up, I think, um, well, the voice would uh, affect, obviously, your, your lyrical content. If the message, um, if you were, your lyrics were not heard properly, um, that might be, um, I guess, the only area you can mark the person down. But yeah. um, it was a good song. Yeah, well, but but based on the nature of the competition, it will be difficult for her, I think, because it's a very tight competition. Very difficult. As we mentioned. Next, Duncan, we have Beetle J singing one master. Be Beetle J used to be a, a, a former vocalist with Signal Band. And um, he's good to sing a song, one master. Sounds like something that we've heard before, the one master um, type of lyric. Um, Topic. Let's um, see if it's similar. Yeah. Um, we hear we've heard songs like One Superpower. Now we're hearing One Master. So let's join Peter J. Ajumbe, Ajumbe. My grandmama is a photo labor, but she do vote in the last election. She say anybody want to see a labor, just tell them touch my little monthly pension. Where were they when I went from work to work? She say, where were they when the country was broke? Who can punish me now if I decide not to vote? I have just one master and I want them to take note. Take note. Who wake me this morning, Jaja? Hey, the food I eat in Jaja. Who is my master? Hey, not no prime minister. Why I still here breathing, Jaja? Oh, in the land of the living, Jaja. My only master hey, is my prime minister. I don't give my more for less to anybody. Keep your forces of darkness far away from me and my money. Who they who they? Hey, 
Achumbe, achumbe Gratitude is an open mantra Someone assists you, always remember But when it comes to slave buyers and vendors My sacred soul, I do not render An apartment is a good asset But my government, they're not ready yet They lodge in supporters with the assistance they give But it's Jah who tell me just ask and you shall receive and I believe Who wake me this morning, Jaja? Ja. Hey, the clothes I wear in Jaja ja. Who is my master? Hey, not no prime minister Why I still here living, Jaja? Ja. Hey, in the land of the living, Jaja ja. My supreme master Hey, he's my prime minister I don't sell my soul as yet to anybody Keep your forces of darkness far away Me and my money Ude Ude Hey Achumbe, achumbe. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Beats, 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 Put your hands together for me, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, Duncan, uh, a, a very good effort by Beatles. I suspect you wrote this song. It it reminds me of something from Dice, though. In it's just the general style, not a copy, but in his general style. I think it's interesting. And it's something I would like to listen a little more to, you know, to follow the development a little more, you know. But um, I kind of like the work he has done, and I know he did it himself, and he should be congratulated for good work. It's a good effort, um, um, Edgar, but the issue that I have with those type of, of topics is that it's the type of topic that you've heard time and time and time and time and time again done in different ways. You know, and um, there's a lot of latitude that that type of topic affords you. And when you have that type of la that topic, you choose that type of topic, you have to be creative, you have to be original, you have to think. And um, it's a good song in terms of, well, it was really simply done. But I think it, uh, it is the type of song and the type of topic that affords you, you know, to really, really, really explore the, the, the lexicon, whether you use in simply language already you lose in more complex language and um, that is what I would have really have loved to have seen um, with the, that type of production you know because you're talking about okay um, ja, um, master master you know you could say one CEO one master is only one this and one that you know there's no other master come with your master card come with your visa card is only one master that trumping them all you know you have so many different things ideas that you could conjure in person's minds and I agree, and um, that it shows the limitation of the writer. But next we have Daryl singing "Do Trouble Trouble." Drop it, drop it. Na 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 na. Yes, I. Eh eh. Na 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 na. What's the excitement about that word called incitement When we're living in a country where one man Is the government whoa, 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 whoa. No law, no order, no constitution He alone to run things down here On his island whoa, 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 whoa. Suppressing the people's back against the wall you think a building wall will never fall 
But you sail in town, that is the troublemaker. Hector's faction, what a wash troublemaker. Dr. Fontaine, a brand new you troublemaker. So power hungry minister, the trouble, trouble, the trouble, trouble. When you trouble, trouble, you will get trouble. You put the country under pressure Our worst Christmas ever So don't trouble, trouble Don't trouble, trouble When you trouble, trouble You will get trouble Hey, hey Na, na, ne, ne Eh, 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 na, 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 Divide, rule and conquer, that's the new world order To be in power forever is the dream Of every dictator Whoa, 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 whoa And some will trade their conscience For marriage of convenience Breeding and government men who will Tell all the people's cause Whoa, 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 whoa When you see them, you must call them traitor And on your step dash them with hot water You have to search for them like Al-Qaeda I have my Navy Seals and my Sniper For some it's called incitement And for some it is just excitement but this Danny Luge, that is the troublemaker. And Moon Sawye, yeah, the man the troublemaker. Blessings and Tony is the troublemaker. So power hungry minister, don't trouble, trouble, don't trouble, trouble. When you trouble, trouble, you will get trouble. Rubies ask you for Sekapa But you have your hidden agenda So don't trouble, trouble Don't trouble, trouble When you trouble, trouble You will get trouble Thank you very much The road The road No trouble, trouble Good. One more time well, for no the trouble, trouble. Yes, Duncan. Um, there was no trouble, trouble. Something I find about the rose, though, like he's talk in a melody, same continuous type of melody. Um, I don't think the song have too much creativity in it. I mean, again, I like to congratulate congratulate people for their effort. There's an art form, and you don't want to pull along each other. But I felt much more could have gone into that song, you know. And it's just a normal political run of the mill to me as. There was does most of the time. He certainly could have done much more with it. What I love about it, though, is the refrain that he is sort of reworked. Because, I mean, in our local palace, we'll say, don't trouble, trouble until trouble, trouble you. And um, he, 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 does a, he has a rework of but it. But we'll speak about it later. Let's join Explosion on stage with a soul. Sure. Our partner Carl, always calling me Explosion, I have to complain Try and see, please find out for me If Hunter eh, my friend again Tell me why, no mind how I try I can talk to the man of late Apparently, he is constantly entangled in matters of state I know you used to be his right hand man When Calypso was the conscience of the nation 
So I am placing all my concern in your capable hands. I said, Carl, I don't want you to misunderstand, but here is my position. Well, it's the latest development happening in this country. If you don't support this government, your future is in jeopardy. It's they who hold the majority. It's they who run the country. It's they who decide ultimately that they want total control. If you refuse to toe the line, you will surely be left behind. Cause labor is in control and we can't argue with a soul. Not a soul, not a soul. But mind what you say, eh eh. See the light, da 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 da. See land When I sold them the land for the labor house. I thought that I had it made But after they played me cat and mouse Cal believe me, I felt betrayed If I had to tell the story instead Well, I would have to write a book But a fish always rotten from the head And a crook is always a crook With all the promises them fellas made that my commission would still be paid. But then again, Cal, I blame myself for believing that young fella. After Ian Douglas had told us the man was done a two tongue, said shit. But it's the latest development that's happening in this country. If you don't support this government, your future is in jeopardy. It's they who hold the majority. It's they who run the country. It's they who decide ultimately if you rise or you fold. Well, I'm sorry, I have to tell you, but this is a party that I can't trust. Cause labor is in control. And I can't argue with a soul. Not a soul, not a soul, Cody Douglas. Mind what you say. Hey, hey, thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Ooh. Yes. Explosion! Uh, an attempt by the explosion there. I'm trying to do some political commentary. We've heard much better. Um, compositions from the um, um, the explosion there that one though um, songs very much like in terms of the melody songs very much like his um, Laiu River or Laiu Bridge falling down um, except that um, the, the tempo it's much slower um, but the melody and the, the chord sequence songs very much at, um, the same um, not one of the stronger songs in the competition it's not um, at the level at which the explosion would normally pitch it in terms of his writing skill, but he's there and he's, um, this is his contribution for 2023. Um, well, what do you think, Duncan, about Sai Humanity that he sings on the Sai Humanity um, melody? melody. Um, yes, yes. It sounds a little bit like it, and it sounds also a little bit. If you play that song and you play um, a Lyo Bridge, um, um, Lyo Bridge is fall London Bridge is, is falling down. Or the Lyo Bridge is falling down. I can't remember the title of the song from last year. It is almost it's almost the same um melody um that you'll be hearing. The only difference um it's the the the, 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 the beat the speed at which the song is being played. Well I think is um, we must congratulate him for at least keeping the vintage calypso yes. alive. And I yes. think yes. I think he's singing on the Sai Humanity melody. So if you look a number of his songs are on that melody. But we have uh, another calypso on the stage. Intruder. Uh, the intruder singing quality of leadership of leader. Yeah. 
We need some help. My son had a SBA exercise. His teacher say to do some researching. Find out the qualities that makes a good leader. He said, check the Caribbean, let's see. Can you point out a good example to me? My heart grew heavy as in my own country. I was struggling to find. Daddy, what is a leader? He should be able to bring people together. What is a leader? He should be an example. A man with honor who is a leader. He should exhibit honesty and integrity. Who is a leader? If he uses office to condone wrong, son, that is no leader. So that you know, the bad leaders always winning the electorate. Yeah. Sorry about that. So sorry. So sorry. I'm not getting what I. I intruded. Yes. It's all part of it, um, Edgar. Yeah, um, uh, from things I heard him start the song, I felt it was a kind of difficult song for him in terms of the melody, you know, and um, I suspect the beat kind of put him off a bit. Uh, maybe. Um, um, behind him, far behind him, are the pull string days. Yeah. Yes. Well, he had a song a um, couple of years ago, a big one. Um, what was it against Cecil? Pull string? Pull not, string? Not pull string, just a couple years ago, and he made it to the semi finals of it. Oh, Everybody was like, yes, walking, walking in darkness. Eyes, walking walking your eyes closed. closed. That was a big one. Indeed. Yeah, so, but he, he normally, he's, he's, his best bet is on that type of pull string. Last, eye closed last, speed. last year, Tempo. last year at the virtual, he had this one um, Creole speaking. Yeah, and it wasn't too bad. Yes. It wasn't too bad, but but this one, just the whole tempo I felt would have thrown him off, you know? I think the lines were a little bit too lengthy for him, and, and so it was not possible that he could keep the, the tone that he would have wanted to, to, to really keep, you know? So he would have found himself going off track. Yeah, next guy sitting on stage. Boom, body, Election call A nation in turmoil People crying, asking, where is leadership, oh Lord? Betrayal is the shout, Byron's report not yet out. What's the hurry? What is this all about, oh Lord? Power resided in one man. Intolerance of opinion to hell with reform. Let's have an election. But it's over. Divide and rule, conquer. More votes, more crooks. Less experience. Brother, it's over. They have dealt another dagger. Now it's too late to close the door. Now the horse is bolted from the stable. Lord, brother, it's over. Let us get together. 
because if we remain in amenity, then I'm sure you would agree that this country will not see prosperity. Yo! Did I die? Boom, ba, de, de. Ba, give me. People running scared Everybody afraid to talk Opposition union weak Her leadership PM say it's time to reset He wants an experienced cabinet So age 23 and 27 Is his best bet They had plenty degree Never had responsibility But his day he entrusts To help him to run the country But it's over Divide and rule, conquer. More votes, more crooks, less experience. Oh Lord, brother, it's over. They have dealt another dagger. Now it's too late to close the door. Now the horse is bolted from the stable, Lord. Brother, it's over. Let us get together. Because if we remain as enemies, then I'm sure you would agree that this country will not see prosperity. Yo! Did I die? Yes, Dan 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 um, it's over. It's over. Um, I think it was all about the place, Duncan. I think it was over. Well, it, it's not really over until the fat lady sings. So, <laughs> <laughs> and the fat lady usually sings. <laughs> and the fat lady does sing. Yeah, and sing loudly too. <laughs> yes. So w when she does, um, he will know um, um, his fit, um, whether he goes or he stays. But as analysts do, I mean, this is very simple. As we, remember what I mentioned about talk show radio? Basically, what you hear on talk show and you put it together and make it rhyme and just make a song. Yes. You know, yes. basically that's what I will do. But again, I guess it's Daniel writing his material. And so he chooses his limitation as a writer, you know? And I think what he has to understand is something that I say all the time, that um, when you're doing Calypso, you have to be in the realm of, of poetry. And um, poetry and prose are different. And um, of course, uh, the newspaper style is usually that of, of, um, of prose. prose yeah. yeah, and he needs um, to understand that he has to be a little more poetic in bringing his message across and in telling his story. That is the only way you can really create an impact on the judges and really be a successful Calypso writer. Yes, Duncan. Next, we're going to have Lady V singing The Old Man. And you know, Lady V, again, another entertainer, female entertainer. You know, more on the comedian side of Calypso. I don't know if this one is a serious one. You know, because she, there's one where she had a hit. Um, 2017, when she sang 
um, the, sp- the spirit. Remember this yeah, song? the spirit. The yeah. spirit. You she know? was I big also, that year. Yeah. I also, I like that song. Everything is five dollars. Yes. Yeah. yeah everything also, is five dollars. It didn't make it big, but it, to me, it was another interesting one from her. Yes. But she loves Calypso and she loves to be on stage. You know, Lady V. Yeah, Lady V from her, her father is Lagum Spirit, right? Yes. A former Old Mad King. Former Old Mad King himself. Yes. 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 Yeah. But we should let our listeners know, though, um, those because they don't have the, the advantage of viewing. That lady, lady V is very shimmery tonight. Yes, let's on stage for Lady V. I met an old man in a party. He was feeling the vibes, but he shy we. I tell the elderly, don't you worry. Just follow my lead and feel free. Do what you want to do. Do what you want to do. That's why you want to dance, feel free, and enjoy the party. You don't have to be Dominican to take part in the celebration. You can be a Lucian Englishman or a Chinaman. Why not me? Come on me. Roll over me. Suck it to me. Hold me tight. Make sure the feeling is right. Tonight, tonight, we're going to party. You don't have to be Dominican to join the action. Jump a little more, wind down on the floor. That's what it takes. That's what it takes. Yes, boy. Yes, boy. Yeah, man. Where the old man and them? Life is short. Enjoy yourself. When I tell the old man, a drink is free. It's now his start. Enjoy the party. The old man hold on to me, rest his two hands on my booty. Squeeze if you want to squeeze, squeeze if you want to squeeze. Work if you want to work, just work, I soon come in. You don't have to be Dominican to take part in the celebration. You can be a Lucian Englishman or a Chinaman. Why not me, jam on me, roll over me, suck it to me. Hold me tight, make sure the feeling's right. Tonight, tonight, we're going to party. You don't have to be Dominican to join the action. Jump a little more, wind down on the floor. That's what it takes, that's what it takes. Yes, boy, yes, boy. Enjoy yourself, the old man and them. Life is short, enjoy yourself. Lady. Lady V, Lady V, V, Lady V, Shimayin, Shimayin, Lady V tonight rolling, hot red, a hot red, hot red jumper. I'm saying to the old man and Rumper, them, sorry. it doesn't matter, life is short, just come and I will make you enjoy yourself. Why it doesn't me? matter even if you're a Chinaman. Or if you are an Englishman or Saint Lucian, or a Saint Lucian, just come and whine on me. Whine on I will me. make you enjoy yourself tonight. Yeah. But what instructions will, will those do? The art of making love, or the art of enjoying yourself? You know, she said party. Yeah? Enjoy okay. yourself. She said party. Okay. <laughs> you just you just allowed to whine on, on, on Lady V in the party, and she was an attractive sight. Yeah, she looked really immaculate. I would say in this hot red romper. And I can imagine an old man seeing that sight, you oh. know, in a party. That's like Viagra, right? <laughs> <laughs> oh, we have Mighty H or Super H. Okay, singing our on our feet again. Watch it. You are the chairman of the Caribbean. Oh, Dominica, oh, Dominica. I'm amazed at your natural beauty. All these years you have been toiling in the struggle. All these years by the miracle. Take your glass now and take a toast 
Raise your hands and take a toast Take your flag and raise it high Be proud of the nature island Take your flag and raise it high Be proud, be proud of this country This is a call to our people For peace and stability we have in this country Marching on together The road to prosperity And believe that we can make We must have plan and a vision For this nation And we got to be strong One hope, one aim One destiny And we'll be on our feet again Hey, watch it Dominica, oh Dominica, you'll always be at our side. Oh Dominica, oh Dominica, don't let no one take you for a ride. All these years that you've been through, things don't happen overnight by a miracle. countries we have a friendship stability we got to keep with the countries we have a friendship stability we got to keep this is a call to our people for peace and stability got to have in this country marching on together the road to prosperity we believe that we can make it must have a plan and a vision for this nation and we got to be strong one hope one aim one destiny and we'll be on our feet again hey who watch it dominica Yes, Duncan, Super H with his patriotic piece on your feet again. You know, it sounds like a nice little song for Independence Time, you know, just asking us to come back, come together and unite, you know. Very, very, very simple writing for a Calypso competition. Yeah, it does sound like an independence production, but um, it's carnival time. Not that it doesn't have a fit here, um, but for the type of competition that you have at carnival time, the type of songs... Um, I think he's um, climbing a, 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 a steep hill there. Yeah, I think so too. He Let's has been, he has been a, 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 a Calypsonian who has been in the arena at eliminations for a number of seasons. Uh, tonight, again, he has come forward um, with a patriotic song, as we said. And um, many a times, you know, we, 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 we hear those songs during an independent celebration, an independent period. But we want to prepare the crowd for the next one, though. It's King Daddy Chess. Yes. His song, He Gas, No Gas. Yeah. And he just released that one yesterday. I heard it. Uh, one that I, I liked. Uh, I think it have an impact. I, yeah, so. I, I, gave him, I gave him one or two of um, my suggestions in, in, in reference to his song. Very good song, I must admit. You know? So yeah. Daddy Chess singing, He, he gas, gas, No, no gas. gas. But normally we hear He Gas, Big ass. Yeah, but Tonight this guy, he gas. No gas. No gas. Daddy Chess, who became monarch in 2001. Let's go on stage. Yeah, man. Mama, 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 Ha! Wait. Let me know. I never see a place like this. Every week is miles practice 
Never a dull moment Is it that the people or the government I hear it about but Somewhere drifting afloat Driving Dominica people antidote Swells in the Caribbean The tanker in between Red your neck, drop the guillotine Papa body, no gasoline Why? He gas, no gas We tired ball, we tired ball He gas, no gas Somebody drop the ball The country fall I have a family, a little baby Come with me jello The bus driver, can make a dollar Boy look misery People cannot come to work Small business gone up in smoke All be the buy out on the shelf Boy, Only in the commonwealth Oi, mama oi Mama oi, mama oi, oi, mama oi, mama oi, mama oi, ha, we man. Early morning frustration, line up in the gas station, the movie on social media. Another day on planet Dominica While Suki in his bed The line reaching Scott's head I hear a man shout Wake up your sleepy head Tension start to rise Man fighting for the prize Water come out in me eyes Somebody help my paradise Whoa! He gas No gas We tired ball We tired ball he gas, no gas, somebody drop the ball, the country fall. I am a farmer, my wife a vendor, my son a truck driver. Up in the country, can't get to the city, I need to deliver. You better know somebody, in the fuel industry. Who can we stay on the shelf? Why? Only in the common web. Chop, chop, chop. Oi. Mama, oi. Mama, oi. Mama, oi. Say it. Oi, say it. Mama, oi. Mama, oi. Mama, oi. Thank you very much. It's good to be back. Love you. Ega. He gas, no, uh, gas. no gas, very creative one. Um, we know recently, just before Christmas, there was this situation with uh, fuel in Dominica, and um, really and truly to pen this in such a quick time and to understand the song and to be singing it like he did tonight really um, is a sense of um, his seniority in the arena. I just said it says it is um, very topical. I mean, we just recently had that gas issue last week, I think it was, and for him to already put a song together on that, that is, that, that is very good of him, and I, I suspect he wrote that one himself. I like the hook though, he gas, no gas, very interesting hook. Um, I would like to see how it's going to develop further though, because um, I, I wonder if it can survive the whole carnival season. That's why that's yeah, that's the problem, because you see, the song has to be very relevant, Yes. Um, and it can lose its relevance. Maybe yeah, but it, knowing Daddy Chess, he will change lines yeah. and do things. And, and, and one of the things that I would maybe ad advise, I don't know if Duncan will agree with me, that in the issue of bidon, um, we saw all colors of bidon. We saw red, we saw blue, we saw white, we saw yellow. And these were the colors of the elections um, this time around. So it would be nice that we can really look at the colors of the bidons and, and make it be part of that calypso. I would agree with you, um, Cecil, because there's a lot of areas in which you could exploit that one. And it's the first time around, first outing for it on the stage. It's the first time I'm actually hearing it. And um, it's a song certainly that can be de developed 
um, further and be a big tune on the night of competition. Agreed. Because that issue of Bido, as you, as one um, example, and the hook line that he has only in the Commonwealth, I think you can develop that much better. And also the one of the he gas, no gas, that could also even be developed better. Oh, oh yes. Um, so it's a song that has a lot, a lot of potential. And um, um, I would not be surprised if you hear a lot of change around of lyrics and um, something completely so, different. So even when he spoke about Suki and he talked about he gas, no gas, you can say he gas, big gas, you know? Well, I mean, and there's it's so only in the Commonwealth. So there's, oh, there's some things, there's some lines that he can actually put that's really put in just but, to dominate. But, but that doesn't prevent him though tonight from getting into the 12 oh no, so far. Oh no, he has oh no, been right no, up no, there. No, no, oh no, oh no. He has been right yeah, up there. So let's, right hope, up there. let's yes. hope our people don't get... Uh, but as we say, the song can... More work can be done and make it even a bigger song. Yes. And the next Calypso is Speak Lock. Yeah. Who will be singing No Light Life. Let's go on stage. I am a security in the city And I want you to know No nightlife No socializing No business No dating So I call in on business people Look into that So we can have some positive nightlife Like in times of Boboy and Wallet now all we have is dogs roaming around And next you know dogs and dogs in the bin Spreading rubbish from the city Back in who 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 hara ra who 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 hara ra I want somebody to come and back like a dog for me Who 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 har 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 we losing the economy. No, 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 no nightlife. No, 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 no nightlife. Stamp your foot and put your foot on the ground. Stamp your foot and put your foot on the ground. If you're walking at night, you have to be careful. You have to look up, you have to look down, and even above, because it have some young men if they meet you alone, they will rob you, they will beat you, and by chance they will kill you. So I want to advise you, if you walk in at night, walk with a company or in a group, because all it have is dogs roaming around and next. You know, dogs and dogs in the bin spreading rubbish from the city. Back in who, 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 ha, 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 who, 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 ha, 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 ha. I want somebody to come and back like a dog for me. Who, 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 ha, ha, ha. We're losing the economy. No, 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 no nightlife. No, 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 no nightlife. Stamp your foot and put your foot on the ground. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Stamp your foot and put your foot on the ground. Bam, 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 bam. Stamp your foot and put your foot on the ground. Well, the pick lock, uh, that's the third song tonight. Uh, 
that deals with the issue of dogs. We heard from Messiah singing Dog Eat Dog and uh, also Mighty D talking about uh, talking dogs. Now we hear this one talking about no light life. But you know guys, I want you all to give me the relationship. I'm trying to build it up in my mind. What's the relationship between no light life and dogs? Well, um, the, the thing about um, Pick Clock is that um, he, he wants to bring a message about nightlife. And he's saying that I mean, the, basically the city is like the nightlife. What it has is a lot of street dogs. And, and that's the nightlife. Yeah, and the that, nightlife that's a, that is in action right now in the city. It's street it's, dogs. It's street dogs yes. barking all around. So he's asking people to put boots on the ground to ensure that they have nightlife in Dominica. I think it's a very good message, Duncan, and brought, uh, brought together nicely. Well, it's an interesting yeah. song. It's topical yeah. um, in terms of the nightlife. Persons come to Dominica and tell you, man, they, they, they wish we had more light, nightlife and that type of thing. And once upon a time, we did have a, a much more light life in the city. It's Cecil. true. He talk about Warwick's and, and Boboy. Boboy, yeah. yeah. And the next Calypsonian is um, Comforter. Although peace, Prince of Peace, Prince of peace. who would do that? Let's go on stage of Prince of Peace. Prince of Peace, yeah. Yeah. What life would be better out here? I pray to the neighbor, my mommy neighbor, even you're my neighbor's calling. I pray to the neighbor, my neighbor, since Rot had left and gone, Kubuli have left and gone, agriculture left and gone, our investors have left and gone, but nothing has been going on. Country in frustration. Why some they are believing, yes, believing, believing everything is nice and dandy. What about the poor people's salary who do that? And so much money going overseas who do that? Some people can't even earn a living who do that? Why some people cannot go overseas who do that? Seems I have to pack up my bag and go. Every year right now is a CEO That is why the man from Trinidad don't go The next in line will be Calypso Who do that? Who do that? Who do that? Who do that? Yes! Prince of Peace When the future should be brighter, oh dear. Nowadays is pressure, I tell you pressure. I went to the market and yeah. Granny Bolin murder, I tell you murder. He say Bello have left and gone. Blue Liat have left and gone. ECP have left and gone. And no one who sees have left and gone. But it's to you how the granny cry She say how oh, will poor people survive While they on the media Yes on the media On the media they spreading propaganda But what the price on people could see And so much people going overseas Young people can't even earn a living While they shining rules out there protesting I have to pack up my back and go. Yo. Next in line, maybe Calypso. Who do that? Who do that? Who do that? Who do that? Hey! Yes, I, Prince of Peace! I love you! I love you! Who do that? Who do that? Breathe. Who do that? Well, who do that? Uh, who do that? Prince of Peace have been said to me, who do that? Uh, uh, good refrain, who do that? But in really 
telling me in song who do that. I already have not got to that part of it. Well, Prince of Peace do that. You heard the error, the big glitch. He had. You know, it's again another simple song, and again, I just want to congratulate him on making his contribution to Calypso 2023. Well, tonight the MCs in Amelia and Dennis, uh, they're both doing a very good job to really entertain and to keep the crowd tonight. It's, it's raining sometimes. Oh, you call him Dennis? King Dice. King Dice. So well there. <laughs> and she's Queen Amelia. And she's Queen. Uh, what's her first name? Amelia. Amelia. Queen Amelia. <laughs> I already said uh, Amelia. Uh, I think she had done some pageant or something, some warp duet or something some years ago, right? Yes. Yes. Yeah. And very talented young lady, though. Very, very talented. Um, Speaks the Creole language fluently, and um, in terms of Dominica's culture, she's very much in it. Um, a very good asset and resource in but, terms of um, the culture, Dominica. Well, I saw her for the independence. She was emceeing most of the, the events at um, Independence, and she did a wonderful job. Very creative, and she knows how to run a show. She yes. she is very serious about running a show. I, I saw her doing the Mother's Queen show, and she actually gave. A wrong with the two yet and that was amazing you know wow. it was amazing actually i took some videos and pictures just to keep to my archive because that for me was really telling someone a young person who understands the culture nice man well she's so, originally from granby isn't she she's yes, that's correct and I, that is the bastion of of curl culture in dominica and i'm a oh. granby man eh? my mother is from granby okay 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 and take I, a I, bow I, it girl take oh bow. i like to pick up myself i've been from granby i take can say bow. my biological father is from granby <laughs> well the next calypsonian will be comforter and he's the one who hasn't been in for a little while for a very long time yeah so welcome back comforter on the stage i never thought i would have seen comforter on stage you know, but let's go on stage for the comforter. But they call me, I will talk. He played me. To my friends and my supporters And all you Calypso lovers What I'm about to say to you It may be sad But it's true So true I decide to stop singing Calypso Because I'm sick and tired Of all this row they want me to sing what they want to hear But they don't want to hear what I have to sing And the way some get in on Like Calypso is their personal thing So before I hit tell blow And then they turn around and sue me like You know I gotta pack up my lyrics and melody And go So to my friends I'm not singing Look I'm not singing Whoa Tonight, I ain't singing nothing. I just come to tell the fans I'm not singing. <laughs> I'm not singing. I sing it Tonight, I ain't singing nothing. Whoa, but I can sing but some so-called Calypsonians who have strong feelings for man. When they know in the sight of God, it's an abomination. But if I ever sing such a composition That will cause too much confusion So I make my decision Are you taking part in this year's competition? Oh, oh, I tell all the things Any little explanation? I'm not singing, I'm just trying to explain to you why I'm not singing this is where you look. Whoa, oh, oh, oh. I'm not singing. Hey, hey. You see, if I was competing, this would be the advice I would be giving. Stop creating division 
over politics for politicians. Yes, this country depending on you and me. So why can't we work in peace, love, and unity? Whilst you fighting down your own brother and making neighbor with the neighbor, them very same politicians out there knocking glass with one another. So many things I want you to know, but I don't want to bless it nobody, ban bobo. Nepota wu kashate lave with the sakia totu ju kavashi. So you say, I, oh, I am singing. I'm not singing tonight, tonight, tonight. I ain't singing nothing. I just come to tell you, fans, I'm not singing. Hey, I'm not singing tonight, hey, tonight. I ain't singing nothing. Don't laugh it. But I can sing, but my good partner, Austri, who give Isaac me pray about this school, they make great. But look, today, they work in the morning. Isaac, speaker of the host of the assembly. But if I ever sing a song on my labor party, I know Black Ma once again will victimize me. So I make my decision. I sing in no song on any politician, not even on Linton. I sing now. I finish up. Good day. Comforter. Comforter. Duncan, I love it. I yeah. love it, Duncan. I love it. Yeah, very yeah. creative. Very creative. He's not singing, but he's still singing. You know, very, very good work. I, I, I love that, you know. Um, I, I don't know tonight whether the judges will penalize him because he actually sang about four verses. Um, because this, the competition is two verses. He sang two, two verses. No, he sang four. No, no, he he sang two, 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 no, two, two, two verses. Two verses. And, and, and at the bridge, he sang about no, Capitonians. It's, it's the way the, the, the song was structured, yeah, Cecil, but it's, it's two, two verses. verses. It's two verses. <laughs> two verses. It's two, it's two. <laughs> two verses. We can, you can go back and listen to it, Cecil. It's two but, verses. But I, I, I would want to um, wager a, a bet that I, it's I, two. I'm, I'm arguing that point that it is it is more than two. It is two verses, Cecil. We will listen later. There is a bridge but, but, in a verse, but it's, still, it's two verses. I, I, let's go on stage for... Uh, the Calypsonian. Um, Give it! Our, our, our good guy. Mass Pumpeto. eruption. Mass eruption. For 23, I say 2023, I got a melody. To free up people, let them free up themselves. So I call it therapy. Could be physical. Or even mental, I bet you go trust me, trust me, trust me to do the job that is required. I only want you to feel me, feel me, feel me. Yo, I've got a melody for 2023, and in this melody, I've got a therapy to free up people's stress, clean up all comments, start dumping dress, and to make sure you protest. Yo. I've got a melody for 2023 And in this melody, I've got a symphony rum pa tum pa tum rabba rabba lum pa tum pa tum Jam rum pa tum pa tum rum pa tum pa tum Na pa na na pa pa 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 na pa na rum pa na pa tum rum pa tum pa tum rum pa tum pa tum this melody has got the tendency to lift people's spirits. Little children and the elderly, man, how quick they just get it. The energy that's derived from this, man, it's so terrific. And when I add my voice, it leaves me with no choice to make it sound like a classic, classic, classic. Yo, I've got a melody for who's stressed politically And in this melody, I've got a symphony rum pa tum pa tum rabba rabba rum pa tum pa tum Yo, rum pa tum pa tum rum pa tum pa tum 
I've got a melody for 2023 And in this melody, I've got a symphony Rum-pu-tum-pu-tum rum pu tum rum pu tum pu tum rum pu tum pu tum rum pu tum pu tum You let me hold Ba-ba-dum Too much stress, man People dying too quick People getting sick, man You know, let go the stress, man Lodge Wow, La Jeu. Did you figure that it ended abruptly? A uh, mass eruption. I, I know that I've been calling for him in the past. Uh, tonight I can't even go on for him because. Well, he got a melody. Uh huh. And I'm not. For, uh, the melody haven't caught on to me yet. I don't know. Um, I'm looking for the melody. I don't know what Duncan thinks. Um, I think mass eruption has seen better days and. Um, He's one of the persons that I've already gone for many times. Um, I think he's maybe, he just might be the most unfortunate Calypsonian in the, in the competition. Songs that could have taken him further, um, he fell. Um, he didn't find favor with the judges. Um, this time around, I think it's going to be a little more difficult for him this time. And um, that's how it is. It's a very tight competition. Um, let's see what happens. But did you hear the, the, the title of that one? I didn't get it though. Something like Who's Out? Adikali Max. Let's go on stage. Play again. Adikali Max at all. Okay. Yeah. Money disappear from Treasury. Me talking about politics. Okay. Yeah. The magician dead already. His bigger heads out of more tricks. Boy, telling you. Harry got man telling me before he walk out But they not checking that they want their hand out So you reach the poor promise them be rich Then have them in a beggar's list Eh, 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 eh But at the end of the day, they don't care At the end of the day, they don't care At the end of the day, they don't care let me tell you what they want to hear It's what they get in their hand This time they not in no five grand They want big thing like hundred grand Some even want those bike and land They cool out they want it They cool out they want it They cool out they like it They cool out they like it They cool out they want it They cool out they like it Pull it out Pull it out, pull it out Reach in your pocket, deep in your pocket Reach in your pocket, deep in your pocket hey. So they want it, so they like it Pull it out, pull it out, pull it out It's that they voting for Hey, da na 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 For call it Hey, hey, hey Don't play no I don't kill the bank song, but the east side facing destruction. Boy, I tell you, do. <laughs> and the big heads, them, them decide to call stop election. What? That all you in? Okay. <laughs> Look for you, you know, they come back around. <laughs> Take people, put them, run out of tongue. What? No, red up the way, step to go look around. Dominica, you know, it's never take with me long. But at the end of the day, they were well glad. <laughs> Start the big truck, even the road path. Mr. DJ, turn up the song and throw a grade and I'll kill you all around. They go cool out, they want it. They go cool out, they want it. They go cool out, they like it. They go cool out, they like it. They go cool out, they want it. They go cool out, they like it. Pull it out, pull it out, pull it out. Hey, reach in your pocket. Deep in your pocket, reach in your pocket, deep in your pocket, eh? So they want it, so they like it. Pull it out, pull it out, pull it out. It's that they put it for. No play, no. Yes, sign. Respect Calypso 2023. It's lit. No play. And the Calypso. Pull it out.
this one for sure reminds me of the good old days of reggae music and then get into dub and um, what we are now hearing those days an elevation or an evolution of calypso tonight um kali adi kali max adi kali max uh, uh, give me a, a new version of, of calypso tonight well um people can innovate and try new things but again when you look at the, the, the material itself though i mean it, i suspect it's something he wrote and he's not too accustomed with the calypso yet so let's hope he can develop as a writer Let's hope yeah, he can learn. I think he can learn and because he seems to be a, a very enthusiastic on stage. So he seems to love the art form and he seems to love the stage as a performer. So it's just a matter of working on his material and I think certainly he can get there. Interest in his name, I think, could, could form the topic of a good, a good, good pun. Yeah, but Chris B is on stage. Free up. Let's go on stage. How you feeling? ding, ding, ding. Gas and election was stressful. COVID dampened our mood. It's time to free up, I say. Musicians were frustrated. Now they are elated. Children can finally go out and play. Lord, frustration kill all we fun. First when their face, you couldn't even embrace. Now we can all come out and exhale, free up yourself from this COVID jail. Juve, when we start to play, it's mass in the land. Say we jump in till Ash Wednesday. Mass in the land, Monday with Triple K. It's mass in the land, we don't care what nobody say. Mass in the land, jump up, can feel oh, if we up. Master Koi, oh, jump up. We don't care what the people so jump up. West side oh, free up. East side oh, free up. North side oh, we don't care where the music go. How you? How you doing? How you doing? How you doing? Up. This year is free up. No stress. No stress. Who have gas? Have gas? Who don't have? No stress. We jamming with decency. Ain't troubling nobody. It's a respite from the COVID fright. Forget about election. Red, blue, the restriction. Dominica is destination bound. Diaspora this time, they come down to vote. But to jam and jam, where they play no boat. Calypso can now go. That second round, the Lord Caressa. Come and have his fun. When we start to play, it's mass in the land. Say we jam until Ash Wednesday. Mass in the land. Monday, we triple K. It's mass in the land. Say we need oh, nobody say. Mass in the land. Can feel jump up, boy. Massacre. Three up, boy. Send your Three up, boy. No stress, no stress, no stress. Jump up. Three up, boy. East side. Jump up, boy. West side. Free up yourself. Thank you! Free up uh, by Chris B. Uh, boy, talking about all the issues pertaining to elections and COVID. Now we have a free up time. I like the arrangement of this one. I, I heard a little of a, of a sparrow bar in this one. Free up. I, I really love the, the arrangement of this one, guys. Yeah, very bouncy beat um in the in the sort of uh, mode of chris b he's that type of um artist who usually is bouncing on stage um in terms of the lyrical content though i know he's had much stronger lyrics and much um better songs i am not sure what was the well that title i think was free up was yep, the title yep. of that one okay so clearly he was selling calling for a free up and it's time to free up um, but um, in the days, I'm not sure who wrote that one for him, but I mean, we know that um, Ian Jackson was his writer at one time and gave him real good material. It was just, just unfortunate. Um, many times he forgot his songs on, on stage. Yeah, well, um, this one, as you, you said, Duncan, very simple. Um, it's like an easy song to make, though. I mean, as if I've heard songs like that before, too. Many songs, you know, that say, the stress is over, the election is over, let us come together, that kind of stuff. 
You know, well, so. the next Calypso then is the Oracle singing Nursery Rhymes. I really want to hear that song. Okay? I suspect that song should have a message in it. Take you back to school. Little Jack Horner sat in a corner eating his Christmas pie. Put in his thumb, pull out his plum, say, What a good buy am I? He saw the death square, they call it Lee. It's very easy to proclaim your own good. It's another thing to do like you should. Why you avoid the light to be knighted in the night. And because of the clinic, our people get lazy, begging daily. And don't pretend like you're nice with everybody. When you're not, and people know you already. A message true for one and all, pride will always cause a fall. Nursery rhymes reveal the state of the times. Nursery rhymes. Not sure what happened. Uh, not sure what happened on stage, guys. It looked like he's having technical difficulties. Move the mic again. Yeah, we that's the first have, time for the night. We have that issue tonight. Uh, that's the food that is that. Thanks God, it is the elimination and not a big, not a big gun, the guys. Yeah. You know because that is. Although I've seen a tipped, a uh, mic, but at the same time, certain things are actually happening. Yeah, but the, um, what do you think so far, Duncan, of the development? In terms of the this rhyme, this, well, it, I I thought it was going to be a little different, but um, we um, the song we just we were just hearing the first verse, so we really have to listen to it yeah. with the other verses and see how it, the he pulls the, the story together. That's how I feel. Yes. Rhymes. Let's go on stage. We take you to school one more time. Little Jack Horner sat in a corner eating his Christmas pie. Put in his thumb, pull out a plum, say, What a good boy am I? That's how they just wear their call lately. It's very easy to proclaim your own good. It's another thing to do like you should. While you avoid daylight to be knighted in the night. And because of the clinic, our people get lazy. Begging daily. And don't pretend like you're nice with everybody. When you're not, and people know you already. A message true for one and all. Pride will always cause a fall. Nursery rhymes reveal the state of the time. Nursery rhymes point to degradation and crime. Impurity, dishonesty. Greed and depravity all lead to perilous times. But God is watching, heart and conscience searching. Judgment is coming for all who, in these times, live in the fantasy of nursery rhymes. You hear me? Listen! Georgie, Porgy, Pudding and Pike kiss the girls and make them cry. When the boys came out to play, George, he ran away. That's how they just use people's body. To pay for scholarship, some must raise their half sleep to get a position. Put the engine to function. Some little children, when the line in bed, must leave the island. And while some strong thing, others not working, but they get in housing. Some would take the case to court, but when it get hot, pay off on the spot. Some care tell their story, while Georgie Pudgy living in fantasy. But nursery rhymes reveal the state of the times. 
Nursery rhymes point to violation and crime. Impurity, dishonesty, greed and depravity all lead to perilous times. But God is watching, heart and conscience searching. Judgment is coming on all who in these times living the fantasy of nursery rhymes. You hear me? Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Good night. The Oracle there, um, one of the seasoned Calypsonians in Dominica. Um, coming a little different this year, um, employing the nursery rhyme um, um, phrase or the nursery rhyme or the life of the nursery rhyme, if we could put it that way, because nursery rhyme does have a life. Um, as children, we all said nursery rhymes, we all sung nursery rhymes. Still today, nursery rhymes are still used today to apply to... Um, theatrical productions and that type of thing. So I think he's using it to apply it to the concept of the Calypso and the development and the telling of his story. And um, he's doing it in a way which is very, very interesting. Or maybe, and Duncan, of course, or maybe Duncan describing certain um, social ills. Well, well, yes, that is the point that I was going to try to make, that he was using it and applying it to our own life in the Commonwealth and the whole um, social political commentary, if you want to put it that way. Very, very interesting. Well, while you look at political commentary, it looks like a, 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 a song that, that really can pertain to people that really are not doing the things that they're supposed to be doing. Although, you can almost say 85% of the song really can pertain to social comment, to political commentary. Social well, political Well, if you like you, Duncan, I, I, I feel, you know, although when I, I, I saw the name, I, I, I wanted to know what you were singing. I was thinking about it differently, but he took it from a different angle. Definitely. And I think he did a commendable job. And that is the point that I make with certain topics. You, there are certain topics that you could spin them so many different ways. And, I mean, the, the, the degree of difficulty in that one is very high because he was thinking there. Yeah. Good evening to everyone. Kaiso, mm. Kaiso. In the broke society, that's usually thinking plenty. I dare red or green or blue, but sometimes it's misconstrued. Using color to detect people's value. Where agents start to sell, to burn my mouth behead. While we pick me, catching a flu. So I am putting color, that will hide in me. I am putting color, the cafe went down me. I am putting color, so I'll be hiding me. Because this colors, but it's too much enemy. Bum, 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 hiding me. Bum, 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 the cafe went down me. Bada, bada, bada. So Ali, I did me, but what I'm from. Cause it's too much enemy. If I use a red, to say I lose my bed. I try wear the blue. See, I go to test my shoe. Imagine in green, but it's time for maturing. And even yellow, call me at your fish show. I have put in color, that will hide in me. I have put in color, cafe went on me. I have put in color, so I'll be hiding me. Because these colors, causing too much enemy. Bum bum, bum bum, hide in me. Bum bum, bum bum, bum The cafe went on me. Ba -da -ba -da -ba. So Ali, I did me, bum 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 bum, causing too much enemy. Whoa, kai so kai so kai so. So give me members 
Because of the clergy Are you allergic to be happy? Missing his hand Then back to his hand Just by his big thing Someone to work Look up in your circle And pitch up his door But your father I don't do So I have put in color That will hide in me I have put in color He got fame with on me I have put in color That I will hide in me Because this colors Causing too much enemy Bam, bam, bam Bam, bam, hide in me Bam, 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 bam He got fame with on me Bada, bada, bada so Ali, I did me, bam, 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 bam. Me could much enemy if I wear a red. Critics say I lose my bed. I try wear the shoe. See, I go throw away my shoe. You writing in green, but it's time for maturing. And even yellow, tell me a yek be sure. I have put in color. That will I be me, I have put in color. The cafe went on me, I have put in color. So Ali, I be me, because these colors too much rigorig me. Bam, 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 I be me. Bam, 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 bam. The cafe went on me, bam, 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 bam. So Ali, I be me, bam, 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 bam. Was in too much enemy. Oh, I so, I so, I so. Thank you. Yes, Duncan. Um, that was the clerk. Me with colors. I find you have a little line there. I put in colors. I, I like to hear it. I don't know. It seems to be resonating with me well. But generally, um, it's not a, a well written song. You know, he's not even a good performer, you know. So I don't think he'll be able to cross this year. I think he should keep on in his craft and you never know in the future. Yeah, indeed. Um, the way the colors issue is brought out is different from other um, songs that we have heard and that is what makes it different you know it's it that would make the song sort of i mean unique um from that perspective um the way the colors issue is brought out um and we know it's a political um commentary and um especially when you're dealing with colors um an election just gone and um but he's is sort of cautioning people you know I mean, he not put in colors, and in, in in the sense that he's warming you. I mean, maybe you shouldn't put colors also because these are the things that can happen to you. This is what is happening to me. This is why he's not, I'm not putting my colors. So it's a sort of caution. Very interesting um, way he's brought out the political issue of colors. Um, Duncan at number fifty-two, we have Phil Bird Cam. I'm not sure what he's singing because he's not on this song. Name is not on this song. Title is not on on on, on the. People will give him. Maybe he might not be there because they've called him once already. Okay, so next is on one tail. What had a, a big hit one of these years. Very humorous kind of Kabisunian. Just might not be there also. Yeah, it looks like it's a good show. Uh, no show. I think they have about three more, right, to add. They have three more names to add to the list. There is about three more. Well, unwanted on my list, I would have been the. Um, That's mine. Somewhere about 52 or thereabout. I think they said they added about three more people, I'm not sure. Um, I, 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 I'm trying to. So we have this. Daddy Major was on the list. My government good. Daddy Major. My government good. Daddy Major. Daddy Major. Yeah. I 
I raised up in poverty. My parents never leave me hungry. I live in Kaibui. No stove, puye, shebo, I see. But when some people will watch today, it's a big difference they will see. My government good, that government nice. My government good, that government nice. My government so nice, everybody doing it twice. That government so nice, everybody getting a slice. Mama, yeah, yeah. Hey. Ba-da-ba, ba-ba. I remember when I was little boy, bananas used to be the number one crop. Every farmer had bananas making dollars in Dominica. But as soon as the black cigar take over, scary sell passport to be Dominica. My government good, that government nice. My government good, that government nice. My government so nice, everybody doing it twice. That government so nice, everybody getting a slice. Hey, Dominica. Hey. My government good, that government nice. My government good, that government nice. My government so nice, everybody doing it twice. That government so nice, everybody getting a slice. Thank you. Yeah, man. My government good. Yeah. Bye. Bye. My, 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 my government. Every, my bro, my, everybody my getting a, is everybody getting a, is everybody my getting a, who have 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 Well, my government good, and you can see the master's ceremony. They are really enjoy, enjoying themselves on that one, on my government good. Yeah, but um, the, uh, I, it's a nice concept, you know, sense. it's a really interesting um, concept by the, you know, if you listen, it's just that it's a right, a lot of sarcasm. Yeah, that, uh, from the time uh, I heard, a lot of sarcasm. The, the topic, yes. I, just, I just realized yes, a, lot a good sarc- level of sarcasm is going to be yeah, man, it's a, it's a, it's a, But I mean, what he needs is uh, somebody to develop it for him, you know, it's a good idea. My government, good, my government, nice. Mm-hmm. Everybody getting a slice, you know, so right. it, that's where the sarcasm is. Yes, uh, yeah. it's a, it's a very nice call. So, so I think that the end is it, it looks like it's the end. And I, I hope the end. I, I, I said one o'clock, but it's now. I remember, I told it was going to go to sixteen about, minutes to two in the I morning. It's going to go about quarter to two. Yeah, yeah. Well, you're about and, there. Yeah. Sixteen minutes to two. Right. So I was right. hoping for one o'clock, but and I said and I said one forty-five. Yeah, you did very well, <laughs> Jesse. And it must be complimented. What's your view so overall tonight, though? Well, well, I think we can say that the elimination is growing. Um, we're seeing more value into the eliminations, and I'm happy that the Calypso Association um, kept their, their their faith in the Calypso and giving them their five minutes fame. Tonight, we have seen more than five minutes fame in the sense that they have grown their, their lyrical content because they, they realize that more people now coming in seriously and look to see what they have, that they're now doing much more work um, in, in presenting their, their music or their songs. Also, too, they know that the, the commentators are very critical on the product that they bring forward. And so, you can see that extra effort is made by the Calip students to ensure that the elimination is not what it was before, but really bringing it to another level. Okay, but while we're at it, I just want to pick up our boy, Gregory Badwill, who is listening in St. Vincent. Yeah, but Cecil, I, I get the point you're making that um, for sure, this wasn't one of the worst eliminations. We can say we heard about 50 complete songs or even more. You know, so again, the Kaiso Association can, can take a bow for, for holding faith in their 55, but I still feel it's a long show. It's way too long, you know, that um, 
for a show of that nature. But tonight, it's very competitive, Cecil, and I know the judge is going to have a difficult task on their hand to choose 12, because it's even difficult for me to choose 12. I don't know what you, what you think there. Well, I, I, I have chosen some 10, and in the 10, I have placed three other people um, that I believe that can go, um, because we need 12 tonight, and uh, the people that I have seen, not that of the judges, the judges' words are final. I have seen Shanice, I see Mighty D, Abia, Son of the Saints, Trilogy, Black Diamond, Daddy Chess, Mystery, Joy, Oracle, and uh, I have three others which can be um, that is Explosion, Comforter, and Little J. Well, I, I, I for sure, I have com Comforter in today for sure. He must be one in for me. Uh, I, 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 I don't see no way that Comforter should make it tonight. You know, but I kind of, I generally agree with both of what you said. You know, but as I say, the judges have a difficult job tonight to choose 12, you know, because it was very competitive. And you had some people put on their best fit tonight, you know. Even people like White Fairy have an outside chance. Did you mention um, this young lady? Um, this, this, this young lady. Um, Joy? Not Joy. The, the other. Ni, Niz, Ni, Nizaya? The Rasta singer. Uh, the, the Rasta? Yeah. Uh, which one? Abia. Abia. Abia, yes. Abia. I did, I, I, you, I did, you did mention her, so. I did have a name on board. Yeah, yes. Cool. So I, I will tell you, I had Shanika, as I said, Shanika. Shanice. Sorry, Shanice, um, Mighty D, Abia, Son of the Saints, Trilogy, Black Diamond, Daddy Chess, Mystery, Joy, Oracle, that is 10. And I have three others that can be chosen from um, Explosion, Comforter, and Little G. Okay, but I, I don't know for what you will Comforter impress me tonight. He did impress me. Yeah. I think he should be in. I would want to agree with you though that Comporter um, should be one of the persons in the um, final list for this evening. Yeah. But then again, um, the judges' decision is final. It was a very competitive show, and oftentimes when you have that level of competition, um, well, persons fall through the cracks. And I would not be surprised if one or two of the certainties or the uh, the persons that we expect to make it tonight. Um, for for the cracks somewhere along on the judges list, but it was a very good show. I did enjoy the show. It's a very it was a very unusually um, competitive show um, for uh, um, an elimination. Usually the eliminations persons hardly come to the eliminations because persons feel that elimination is not up to the standard. Well, tonight show I think certainly was up to a, a very good high standard tonight. I I think though what really helped it creating that. Um, is the, the the trio of the swinging stars bad and um, before we would just maybe have um some person would sing a cappella um and some persons would just maybe depend on on at the time refuse playing bass and with um peter uh, tonight we had a trio and out of that trio you know we we, we did we did see um quite a lot of um of, of the of the musicians oh sorry the the, the calypsonians actually doing their best. Yeah, but yes, I, I, I just want to say that, that even more than just the, the backup band, it's the first time in an elimination that you did not get too much half-picked songs. Most, mostly everybody there had their two verses and their two choruses. Even a lot of thunder tonight. Well, I'm song did complete tonight, you know, so I I felt we had a, it was a, was the winner tonight. Yes, yeah, so hats off to the organizers and hats off to the competitors for a wonderful um, show. And I'm looking up Duncan to a really, really big season because I, I suspect that guys have been honing their craft, doing what they have to do to get that competitive edge. And I expect us to have some really, really big calypsos this year. And, and I'm waiting to see the big Gundys this year, what they're going to be giving. Because I'm sure that they would evaluate what they saw tonight, especially that of Trilogy. Um, knowing that Trilogy came, came out with, uh, with his best foot forward and and is looking towards maybe even to the finals and and i'm saying that um the senior calypsonians this year um would evaluate some of the songs that they would have heard and maybe go back to the drawing board yeah and i agree but uh, while we're saying it now um so 
Uh, so, well, well, Trilogy, so who do you say be your number one tonight, Trilogy? I would say Trilogy is my number one tonight. Okay, and I, I, I cannot disagree in a way because I mean, when it comes for what we're looking for in Calypso, the creativity, the art, yeah, I mean, he had everything tonight. Right? What he need to work on for sure is make sure that he get a rendition on point because when he get to the next round, remember, rendition is going to be judged in the next round, so you have to ensure that he gets this rendition on point. Because at a certain time uh, while he was singing, you, you could have sensed that his voice was cracking. You know, right. He's yeah. not accustomed to Calypso, accustomed to the Buyo, fast range. Uh, but you could have sensed at a certain time, where, especially when he went into the second um, verse, that his voice was, was cracking a bit. So he has to work quite a lot on that part. Yeah, make sure that he understands, as you say, Calypso is Calypso and Buyo is Buyo. And you have to take a tempo where he can actually um, sing so that people can understand every line. That he think that it can be that he have good articulation and good diction. I don't know what I do not know what um, Duncan thinks. I mean, he was very strong tonight. He fit, certainly was very strong. Um, he may have been the number one. I I would not argue against that. I mean, I'm not sure what the judges were looking at, but um, um, certainly um, if the judges um, um, decided that he was the number one, I would go with it. I would have no problem with that either, Duncan, because he had one of the best songs for tonight. We also had Shanis, as we said, with this um, internet song and the... the uh, it's what? Just call, it was called Hack. Hack. Hashtag. 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 hashtag, hashtag, hashtag yeah. I'm, I'm concerned. Yeah, had, had, uh, yeah so um, this one resonated was very a big well song with also. me mm. because I, I am very concerned. A lot of people are lament. Even this morning, my wife and I was having a discussion where that I mean everything that we just record everything and we just put it on social media, don't care about people's family and how they feel. You know, some people see their, their children die first time on on, on Facebook social or social media, you know, somebody send them a WhatsApp or, or whatever, you know, and I mean you it, 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 it's not nice. So I'm happy. Even um Black Diamond and that Right. I, I was saying that I I, I I would even read Black Diamond right up there. Right because, up there. Um it's an issue that we are talking about in the Caribbean. It's not just a Dominican issue. Um, and there are some other countries. We, we saw that Australia themselves, um, some time ago, many years ago, that they were talking about reparation. And uh, we saw that the, the British had to apologize to them and give them what was required of them. And so uh, this is a topical um, issue that will go for a long, long way. It will always be relevant. It can be used in the next 10, 15, 20 years. No, but you, but what what was what is most important of the song um, from Black Diamond is the way he brought out the story, and um, you have to give the writer full marks for um, having structured or crafted uh, um, that piece in the manner in which he did. That was going to say the development is so you know I mean he takes you on that trip to England. You know, I, I never knew where he was going. You know, <laughs> none of you us know, knew. You know, this old lady sent him to England to a funeral. You know, and it is really, really good art. And that, that's what we have been looking for. I don't think we want to see more of that. We hope that the, 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 the more known artists for the next rounds, that, that, that they, they do their work too. But let's hope also that the judges can appreciate the work of the um, artists in that regard. The well, creativity. I, I've reached a point in my, in my life where I, once I appreciate the calypso and I hope the public appreciate the effort we're trying to make to improve the calypso. And I saw improvement tonight, as I said, and we hope that every time soon then we realize that, you know, let's, let, let's make the thing an art. Not stop. Uh, we know you want to sing certain topics. You're free to sing any topic you want. I mean, you can bash government if you want, but let's do it in a way. I mean, when, you, when we just spoke about trilogy, mm -hmm. I mean, it's a political strong song, a strong political on Strong political on the tour. Uh, yeah, but so well crafted. Mm -hmm. Even who he may be thinking about can have a good laugh. Yes. They can enjoy it. And know? applaud it. Yes. You know? Oh, yeah, and so that's what it is. Yeah, that's you what know, it is. It reminds me of AMPM. You remember the, the, that early days of, of Checo? Yeah, right. So, so, so it's, it's, it speaks volume of when Calypsonians can really go back to the joint ball or can determine that they're going to take their art and make it different. Even Dice, if Animal Farm, I mean, that I mean that was a creative one, you know? So that, that, that's what we're saying. I mean, you can bring out your message, you can hit hard. But in and uh, we have to remember how we also started. You know that guys used to sing to the master, they criticize the master, but they play the master. The master think they say something nice to them, you know. But well, really, I know, well, it, it, they use all the different, they use the sarcasm, the, the double tongue, whatever they, whatever tool to get through to master. No, uh, also to this guy who sang Titi on Berry tonight, uh, sang Selling Cock. It was really well put together, well masked. And um, it, the, the presentation, the delivery of this one, 
tonight on stage um, is a clear indication that I would have liked to see the judges in terms of his um, lyrical content as to where they would have placed him um, on their score sheet. Well, I hope the judges do not get offended. You know, <laughs> I remember Duncan was saying a while ago, sometimes judges get offended. And yes, I hope some yes. of the sin doesn't suffer, you know, because he he said somebody might take their their own personal the, interpretation. The, 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 of the, personal the only view. thing maybe I would have done if he did maybe put something bottle cock, you know, play around with it. You, you understand what I'm saying, Duncan? Because yeah. you have different types of cock, you know, so you could play around with with it, so it's not just um six chicks to the rooster where we can. But I guess it's the rooster he's selling, so. But if there's one song I know persons will remember is the song of the cock rather yeah. than the rooster. <laughs> 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 that that makes quite a lot of sense, yeah. you know. So I hope it's a pretty uh, very, very well done sequel, you know. So he took from the hype of um mystery from mystery, last year yes, yeah. and came and you know really did a uh, so I hope for his sake that he makes it to the next song. He's one guy I know that the judges sometimes overlook. A lot, you know. I remember two, um, two. It was two years ago, not the last hotel, but the one before. I felt he had done very yes. well, and they overlook him. No, to and also to, uh, I looked at um, mystery um, tonight, and I think she did credit to herself in in the way that she was able to present tonight. Yeah, but because of the tightness of the competition, I think the is the strength of, ma of her material can affect her. I don't think it was. I I think what it, the, her issue really is not that this song is not, not a good song, but I don't think she was properly rehearsed for the evening. I think that might have been the problem, because you can hear you can hear the development of the music, you can hear the development of the the the, the story, but it was not as effective as she was last year, where uh, from the first from the get go with um Coco, um she was a big hit. I think um, maybe she needed some more practice with that, more rehearsal, so she could really um, hit the, the, the punchlines as effective as she, she needed to have done with the music. So I that also feel, Duncan, that she's going on a rampage, and I never really felt oh, yes. well, that, that I didn't coming feel that. through yeah, I didn't in, feel that in, part in the lyrics, you understand? No, I agree with that. Yeah, that, 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 that was some, sometimes when you sing right up, uh, and you, you have heard the other material before you, and you're not so sure what's behind, you take it for, for granted that you can just go out there, knowing as to what you've been doing in the past, and take it for granted and sing, sing very flat. Um, but I, I'm not so sure tonight, you know, that um, I would not have placed her into, into the quarters. Well, I, 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 I have a borderline. She can I think she's on the borderline, you uh, know. But you never know, yeah. I mean, but she's on the borderline. Yeah, I have yeah. a borderline as yeah. one of the people. But uh, Cecil, I would want to agree with you, though. I mean, I we've told the, the the listeners what we think in terms of the persons who are likely to make it, and I would want to agree with you that um that the 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 list that you called are the are the persons who are very likely to make it. Possibly, um, the judges might see it different, and maybe two, three, four of them might fall with, um, between the cracks. But um, uh, overall, I would want to agree with you on terms of the list that you presented. And as they indicated, we're not going to get the results tonight. Um, we're going to be, well, this morning, we'll be getting it later today. The Cecil, I'm sure you'll have it by 6 o'clock um, on your mobile phone. Mm -hmm. And um, it will be announced on the radio, various radio stations. So, I mean, most we can do is to tell everyone that they have a pleasant morning, a pleasant evening. Thanks for the company. And um, we hope to have them with us in our company. But, but before we do that, yeah. Duncan, I think yes. we should give kudos to the Calypso Association for a, a, a good piece of art that they place out tonight. Well, that was indicated earlier. I think we said so earlier. Okay. Yeah, that we, I mean, we must commend the Calypso Association. It was a very well-organized show. The Calypsonians seem to have been well prepared, apart from a few. Overall, the, the competition was very tight and tough. And um, I think the, the this year's um, Calypso season is going to be a big one. And the trio, the trio did justice to tonight's competition. Yeah, but I, I, I just want to say one thing again. You know, we like to talk about, remember that this thing supposed to be doing virtually. The background on the stage, those things, they need to yeah. work on, on on that. The Calypso Association need a big... Marketing and publicity. They need a bigger banner to really, if they want to push the Calypso Association, let's put a full banner on the Calypso Association, whatever it is. I also believe that the Calypso Association should get um, one of the sponsors, um, the people who are actually sponsoring the event to get their public relation of um, public relation people to really help them, or marketing people to really help them to, to, to decor 
uh, to do deco because I think it is somewhat shabby. Even if it's elimination, it's going out there. People are looking at it. It's not that only that they are looking at or listening to the to, to the music, but they're also looking at um, the stage and, and would give their own critic. And then remember, we're talking now about digital stuff. You know, you can actually do advertising digitally, so you could do that kind of work happening in the background. You know, on on, on this when the performer come there. So instead of all those cloth, you know. All the flow, well, let me don't call companies, but the plastics and the whatever on the stage. Mm -hmm. I'd really like to see that this year that we take this stage to a different level. And we have people in Dominica that can do that and make mm -hmm. it look good, you know? Yeah. Because so we, saw, we saw during the, 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 the past election um, where the political parties were able to actually get uh, the, the, the kind of um, hard features that would really allow people to have a wow effect and well, i think the kind association needs to do that now yeah they need to get to that level for the second biggest show in dominica they need to they need to get to that level i must say that you know you know um duncan um and um edgar i, I think what I, I would like to do now is to have a small chat um uh, with, uh, with an incoming um calypsolian uh, trilogy tell us what you felt tonight Chila. Yeah, man, well, you know, it was my first time. And, um, you know, honestly, I had a little bit of jitters um, just just before I started. But then, you know, once you, on, as a true performer, you know, once you touch the stage and you come to do what you have to do and you handle your business, you know, everything. Um, everything flowed so nicely and I, I felt I felt at home, you know. Um, it, it, it was a, a performance, so to speak. It's a competition, so you know that's a different, a different game, a different ball game. Um, but you know, I feel I feel a little confident in in what I did tonight. You know, I, I realized that you you came in and um, you you gave the world the listeners um, a, a new feel as to what um, broadcasters have been talking about in reference to the, the materials in terms of a good calypso. Uh, how were you able to go through through, through your pen, placing on paper to, to, to find yourself writing such a beautiful song? Um, well, basically, I, 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 I seek inspiration through all forms of music, and, and I don't just stick to, you know, just keeping myself in one box. Um, so basically, I end up falling in love with the Trinidadian Calypsos. You know, that's, that's what actually made me like the art form of Calypso. And everybody keep on, you know, encouraging me and, and telling me like, yo, you should give Calypso a try. And, you know, I thought about it for a couple of years, but then I, I, I made myself, you know, get a little more seasoned in the business of making music and even writing music. And, you know, suddenly the idea just came to me. You know, the idea just came to me because, you know, certain things happening in the, in the country and it really... When you when you put it in contrast to other countries, you know it looks like we heading down that path, you know. But um, you know, I didn't want to to make it something that was too serious, you know. I wanted to have fun with it, you know, because calypso, you know, is something that you can either you can take any route, and I decided to go the fun route. So that's what I came up with, um, and that's what I stuck to. You know, well, um, quickly, yeah. quickly, um, quickly, I'm um, Edgar. Um, we know now in the dictionary there's a word called friend enemy. Enemy friend, what, what's it called? Uh, friend enemy. Friend enemy. And, and I heard you sang a, a line talking about uh, trade dicta. Help me with the word. I'm, I'm, it, I'm always stumbling on it. You're talking about the, the dictatorship? Dictatorship. You, you think that's going to be in the dictionary sometime? <laughs> well, you know, it, it might have a word that sounds very similar to it that's already in the dictionary. So, you know, we can, we can, we can go with that word still. But dictatorship, I'm not too sure. Well, what, do you, what do you mean when you, say, when you, when you use that word? What, that dictatorship? Yes. No, well, basically, um, if you listen to the Calypso, it's talking about it's a story of a man who came to Dominica um, back in 2004 and he started building a ship. So basically, that's that's it's not it's not really one word; it's a phrase. It's dictator ship. I'm telling you guys in the calypso about dictator's ship. Yes, yes, about dictator. Yes, I'm talking about dictator in the in the song. So it's not really one word, you know. 
Well, Louis, I've not heard that rhyme in that, but if you want to go ahead and, you know, make your assumption, that, that is up to you. <laughs> Very good, youngster. I've been following you for a while. I must say, I'm always impressed with your lyrics as a your artist. Thank you. Thank I mean, you. since I used to do shows at colleges to perform for us, yes, and, yes. I always, and, and, and my children always play your music at home too, that because it's very clean because we have an Eastern Dominican music now. I find it going a little astray. Yeah. So I really want to congratulate you on that and I want to congratulate you on that song and I'm very happy you come into Calypso. Thank, I thank always you used to much. think, why this guy doesn't come into Calypso? Because <laughs> he's so lyrical, you know? So I'm very happy. So where do you see yourself in this Because Are you preparing other songs because you may go far? Well, yeah. So basically, you know, I came into the Calypso I, when I come to, when I try to do something, or when I do something, I like to do it wholeheartedly. You know, that's what I believe in doing something to the best of your ability. And um, I, 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 you have to go for it. You have to go for the top. You know, you have to go for the top. Like I said in an interview I had um, with um, another radio station, I told them, you know, shoot for the moon, and if you land on the stars, then at least you know you you reach. Somewhere for the stars, and if you land on the moon, then you reach somewhere. Yes, yes basically. Yeah, yeah. So you know, I I go in, I go in for it. I go in for everything. I go in for everything. You know, people say, well, okay, you're a boy artist. You, you come in and you it's your first time, and uh, you know they saying, well, you know, you, you reach wherever you reach. And I don't do that. But that's was a boy artist too. So and go so if you as you far think as about possible, it, you know. Um, you have a bridge, question, bridge, bridge, Jungle, you have question? No, no, no. I've been listening and following. I think he's a very um, promising um, Calypsonian, I would say. Um, and of course, t- evidently from everything he has said and everything he does and everything he presents, he is not only um, a good Calypsonian, promising Calypsonian, but he's a very well um, renowned artist. I mean, up- renowned and upcoming artist, I would say. And um, one can only um, encourage him, and um, I um, encourage him, and um, um, well, what should I say? But h- hope that um, he might. You never know. With everything that he has said there, he just might crown this year. You never know. <laughs> wow, <laughs> <laughs> I'm not ready to say that yet. That I, 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 I wait until the recording so and everything. So, so hearing that um, trilogy, do you have a second song there? Well, I mean, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a fountain of ideas, you know. So I have ideas flowing in my bloodstream, left, right, and center. Um, some of which I can even disclose, you know, because I'm so confident in myself. But you know, I leave that, I leave that, I leave that for when the time is right. Well, you, you and I have actually started writing a second song, you know, just to prepare for if, if anything, if if the need calls for it, you know. Well, ideas are for free, yeah? and um. <laughs> Ideas are not something you can copyright, so you can always um, share them ready uh, because you can't really copy ta- co- copyright ideas. So if you're will, willing to, you can share them, but no. um, you cannot copyright them, so it's better you keep them to yourself yeah, for now and um, develop your ideas, develop your music, right, develop right. your song, and, um, and come and do your thing on stage. Yes, yes. But sure, I also want sure. to encourage you, though, to keep on writing and write for other people because the writing, in terms of the music industry, it's the writing is the the writer get the most in terms of copyright. Right. So I, I actually like the fact that you said that. Um, there's also somebody else I wrote for that singing Calypso this year. Yeah. And it's I don't want to disclose yet. I really want to see how far the person going to retrieve this song. And then if I see, okay, either this song is a hit song, the song can probably by for road match or the person reach a certain distance then you know but the person haven't competed I, will, I will disclose that they information haven't competed yet. they have competed tonight you understand so I mean it's up to you I like I, to what I can do I can give a hint the song the song can can tackle road match you understand and the song is there a good song not contenders that we had I mean tonight. if you if you probably listen if you go back you listen to it you might get the little trilogy flavor in the person's style but I don't want to disclose it yet. Let the person do their thing and... I hope it's not sort of the same. I don't know. No. <laughs> <laughs> you tell us. Eventually, he will tell us. He, will tell us. a diplomat. He, he does not like want that. to disclose <laughs> like for, um, like for the time being. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, certainly, um, my brother, you are a very promising artist. Thank you so much. And by the way, Duncan, he works at the um, central... N- uh, NCC. 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 Oh, no. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Before you leave us, producer, because many a times, people, people, people talk about the Calypsonians, Talk about the writer, but they hardly talk about the producer. Right. I must big up um Peter one time. Peter later. You know, he 
kind of like showed me the ropes and he, he take me on his wing so to speak and you know, he, has, he has assisted me with the production of the song and I'm very 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 grateful so far from all the help that everybody's been giving in big up my giving me sorry my NCCU family and to big them up you know I I rehearsed for them probably like three times alone today <laughs> you know because they want me to be on my <laughs> P's and my Q's <laughs> yeah, you know and um, I also want to big up my immediate family and all my friends all my supporters all my fans some would even say I break Facebook tonight, I break social media, everybody was, you know, thriller, thriller, team thriller. So, you know, big up the team one time and also my team, my management team, you know, for pushing me and believing in me to go up for the Calypso. You know, it's just eliminations. Um, hopefully, I make it to quarterfinals and make it to even, you know, the finals. So, that's that's how I'm taking it right now, just one, one step at a time. Just wish your dad was around. Yeah, well... That's life, man. You yeah. know, you watching, you watching and smiling. You pray, right? Yes, I. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. man. This song is not I pray, huh? Yeah, pray, pray. Yeah, pray, yeah. pray. Yeah. I yes, love that song, my brother. Yeah, man. Thank you so much for having me, guys. Big yeah, up. man. Yeah, man. Yeah. Take care. Well, Donk, I'm um, Duncan and uh, um, Edgar, you heard it? Yeah, from Trilogy. I love him. A humble, yeah. young person with a lot of talent, bubbling with ideas. Remember, he said he bubbling with ideas. And Calum says a good place for him to come to. Yes. That will help him on his writing and yeah. even become a better writer. So Duncan, as you were saying earlier, I mean, um, it's a late night, and I mean, it was wonderful having you on the broadcast and also uh, working with Cecil, and I'm sure we have a long season where we have a lot of work to do together, and I guess um, workers will join us and, and James and all the other people. Yes, and I just want to say yeah. thank you to Duncan and to you also, Edgar, and James, who is not here this time, for the kind of broadcast that we were able to bring to our listeners. Um, we have always found ourselves as a national radio station to be different, to be apart, and um, to really bring it across to the people as we hear it and as we see it. And uh, tonight was a clear evident, a clear evident of what we were able to bring forward uh, to the many listeners. And we are sure we can assure you, Duncan, that in the quarterfinals you're going to even see much better calypsos. Thank you to the listeners. Thank you, Cecil. Good working with you, Edgar, as usual. Um, Cecil, of course, always taking advantage of us and calling us at the 11th hour, but we do it for Calypso. Thank you, guys, and thank you to um, my technical man, and um, that is um, Dean Thomas and Aaron Wilshire, and also that of my IT man in the person of Nichols. Uh, thank you very much, guys, for the work that you have been able to do for, to, for our listeners, and, and we will be also be doing a production of the for you to view what we have done tonight. And so, for me, from my team to the listeners, we want to say thank you very much. We go back to Ted Daly's studio. <laughs>